Okay. I'm all ready to go. Are you, honey? Yeah. Yeah? Hey, you look great. Looks great on you. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no, you're good. Um, I got all my things ready, just in case, you know, of anything. Got the sword. Yeah, I should probably... I got some food, too. I should probably grab my things. Yeah, okay. I only got a few things, too. Um, bringing some boats, because I think we could just travel over the water rather than walk. Um, okay. I don't think I need anything else. I brought some apple cider, you know, brought some coffee. And uh, I got my uh, acetaminophen. So I'll be finishing mm -hmm. it off tonight. Start the new year off strong. Okay. Also got some my armor. You can bring some armor too. I got a lantern just in case it gets dark. Uh, yeah, and that's it. Yeah. Oh, that's right. I've been holding off on giving YB uh, the prescriptions from the other day. So, okay. do, do you want to give it to him? You can. It's in your hand. It, it doesn't have to be in my hand. I mean. My hand could be in your hand. Do you want to give it to it, YB, or not? I'm just worried. I don't want to stir shit up right now. And that's a new addition. I think maybe it would be best yeah, if sure. it came from you. Do you mind? It hasn't really talked to me since last breakfast, so... Okay. Okay. Here. I'll just wait over here. If it's I'm home. coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, what? We just want to get your attention. What's up? Are you ready to go? Yeah. Okay. Are we supposed to be dressed up? I don't know. I... Honestly, I don't know. I heard it was kind of formal, just kind of stay warm, and I'm feeling warm, so we should be good. And you look plenty warm. Yeah. I mean, I'm warm, but I don't think I'm that fancy. This jacket is old as fuck. Well, you know what, Melody? Maybe we should bring our winter clothes just in case. I'm going to grab mine from okay. my chest. Um, just in case that we do have to change. Okay. I'll bring it with me. I should go grab my stuff, too. I left it in down here. Right. Hey, man. How you, uh... How are you feeling? Fine. Yeah, that's good. Um, we're swinging by the pickup Casper, right? Yeah. Okay. So it'll be the four of us, and uh, what about Jazz? Is she poking around? She is already off doing something somewhere. Maybe she's watching over someone over there in Asphus, or someone who's going there. Maybe we'll see her there. Maybe. Maybe. Um, listen, I don't want to say much about it, but you know, before we get going, I want you to know... Uh, uh, I let Melody do the talking. I know you don't want to hear from me, but maybe it'd be best if you start that up for the new year, you know, a little resolution thing. Go ahead at your own pace. I'm just telling you that we're thinking about you, okay? Can we not do this right now? Okay. I'll leave it that. You ready? Have you ate? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay. All right, let's go pick up Casper then. Yeah. Oh, that's... Okay. Really gotta get that fixed. Melody? Oh, there you are. Alright. To Casper's we go. Casper's we go. You know, it's funny, looking back, I don't even remember when we last celebrated New Year's here. I don't even think we really did in Marigold. It was too... new. Also, we were kind of dealing with Sharma, so I don't think it was on anyone's mind. But hey, Not really. now things are looking good for us, you know? Something like that. It'd be nice to go back to Aspis again. I know you've been. I've never been. Really? Nope. Typically, you're the one that goes, and I gotta stay behind. But that's alright. Yeah. 
I know Sai's always talked about showing me his stuff, and, you know, I haven't had a chance to really go. Plus, I don't know, still feel bad about leaving. Still... I don't know. It feels weird, all of us leaving Marigold. Yeah, but, I don't know, we've had four months of peace, you know? No sign of Richie, yeah, no sign of we're... any bad shit. Four months of peace could easily turn into one big awful awful thing that happens and then all of a sudden Marigold is blown up and in smithereens and it's all our fault because we left to go have a party let's hope that it's New Year's and maybe everyone's on break okay I'm just trying to think positive Casper I, I think we need this hi, hi. hi Casper hi guys hi how's it going hi uh pretty good you guys ready to go uh, yeah just yeah. About, um, if you're ready yeah, I think I should be. Um, I was saying that, uh... Ah! Oh! Max! What the fuck was that? What the oh my god. fuck was oh that? Oh my god, what the fuck? What the... F what is he? What, um... What, what, what was that? It was like a blur. My... Yeah. What? I... Uh, uh... Are you okay? Is that a friend of yours? What's he doing here? What is he doing? That's not supposed to happen. That's not supposed to... Good news! There seems to be more than one life here. Minus, uh, what the fuck were you thinking? What the fuck was that? I... okay. I built a proto... I, I had to go off of one of your old blueprints. It didn't... I can't build it as good as you can! Uh, but it what worked. I tell uh, you about the prototypes? They're not stable. You could end up a hundred feet in the air which is i mean what? you did just fall God from the it. sky it uh i think it broke on uh landing a little bit uh so that might yeah. not yeah I just use one of the freaking useful ones they're like mass produced at this point about that hey uh guys hi how's it going jay here um is this a friend of yours casper um, okay. Uh, Jay, Melody, Wybie, meet, uh, my partner, uh, from the Empire. Midas. Midas. Uh, nice to meet you. So, same situation as Casper, right? Well, hello? Yes, sure. Yeah, close enough. Anyways. Okay. okay. What's um, going on? Where am I? What's this? What's... Um, um you were in Marigold. Hi. Uh, it's a town, city. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We're on. What the fuck have you been doing? We'll talk about that in a bit. I don't uh, know. Okay. We have somewhere to come. You're coming oh. with us. Oh, okay. Well, we have somewhere to be, don't we? Yeah. Yes. yes. New Year's yeah, party okay. in another city, not that far from here. It's a good boat right away. Um, I have boats for us. Um, maybe not enough for all of us though. Uh, we'll figure it's it out. Fine. Well, it's well fine. yeah, it's fine. Um, actually, I do have four boats mm -hmm. on me. So if Melody and I take one. YB, you take one, and then you two take one. All right. Sure. Okay, I guess that'll work. Okay, so um, you two can catch up on your own. Um, I mean, I prefer the whole no secrets thing that you promised us, Casper, would carry over to Midas here. I mean, we're pretty in well in, in the know. Did I ever... Did I promise that? Okay. Yeah. A, a okay. few others that are also not here, but, like, you know, people know now. I mean, is there anyone okay, else well, you're we'll not keeping the truth from? Well, I mean... I know secrets. Do you mean, like, not playing dumb around you guys? Yes. We know what you okay. will do. And what I thought you, you meant, like, no secrets in general, and, you know, that's kind of... Let's get moving. Yeah. Which which way is... I've only ever taken the nether. I've also only ever um, taken the nether. I kind of know the general way. Um, I told Simon last time he was here that I'd probably take the boat, because I really prefer you know, our group not be walking in forests the whole time. We might be safer on water, so. Um, you kind of pointed me in the right direction, so. 
I I do know the idea. Also, yeah, Midas, welcome to Marigold. Oh, yes. Uh, thank you. It's a town that's been here for a little while, not too, too long, but, uh, yeah, uh, we, we, we got beautiful. lots of things. There's a library here, there's a hospital, a hotel right here. Oh, we got it all. Yeah, there's a lot more, but, uh, but yeah, we'll head to the docks, which is on the other side of Marigold from where we are, so. Yeah. And we got about, uh, 13 minutes to be where we need to be, so. Let's hope we boat fast, all right? Are you okay? Any lingering side effects from the respawn? You're you're good? Uh, I think so. Okay. Don't scare me like that ever again. Well, I'm here oh now. <laughs> well, yeah, and and I'm glad that you're here. That scared the shit out of me. If it's any consolation, it scared me a lot, too. I was not expecting that to happen. This is why My... don't use prototypes. Well, I didn't have anything else. I had to build it from scratch. So, uh... Build no, it from scratch? I'm so yeah, proud Yeah, no! Of you. That's why it fucking looked so bad and worked terribly. <laughs> How long have you guys known each other? Um, if you guys are from the same universe, right? Four? Four years. That's that's yeah. close enough, oh. right? It's been it's been four years. Mm hmm Alright. Um just careful in the ice guys. Oh, I'm waterproof now. Um, oh yeah, I heard about that. That's what YB mentioned. That you underwent some things. Um here, a boat for you too. Uh YB a boat for you. And a boat for us, Melody. Uh, you know how to boat, right, Wybe? Yeah, I just not stable on the ice. Yeah, don't worry. Okay. It's, a, it's a little slippery. I'm not gonna fall in. I'm not gonna fall in. I'm not gonna fall in. You're right. It's freezing, so try not to. All right. Um. And you can't swim. And yeah. you can't swim. You can't. It's so. freezing. I can't swim. It's Let's okay. I in. pull you out. I'd appreciate that. All right. Um. So which way, Jay? Everyone, follow me. Are you the reason that the readings were all over the place, Midas? Um, okay. About, I'm not really sure about any readings. I'm not the most technologically inclined, but I, I don't know if this is the best time to tell you, but um, there's a bit of a problem with Empire right now, and there's a reason I couldn't use any of the other built already teleporters. Um, you know, Deimos had a little bit of a, well, it's fine. We could, we could talk about it later. I'm not really sure. I don't know about these people. I don't know. Is my dad okay? I don't know. Shit. I got out as quick as I could. Um, that's reassuring. That's why it took me so long. I'm sorry. No, it's, I'm glad you're here. Things have been a bit of a mess, but... I mean, I've, I've made friends, which is kind of a everyone. first for me. Oh, God. You guys good back there? Yeah. I'm keeping an eye on YB. I believe it was right around here. Uh, apparently it's about to be 2006, uh, here. Wow. Yeah, it's, uh, it's New Year's now. Is what they call it. Oh, yeah. I guess it's, uh, something sort of like New Soul. No, back um, where I'm from, we used to do New Year's. Yeah. 
I remember Emperor Perseus mentioned it a couple of times, but... Yeah? I am... Um, we're going to this place called Asphus. It's a kingdom ran by Anna Brinton, is her name. She's a mm -hmm. phoenix. That's kind of neat. Yeah. And we're on good terms with her. And she's a good friend to all of us. So, uh, try not to, uh, you know, weird her out anything if you guys start talking about outer universes or whatever it is. Yeah, no, we... I don't I'm even think only... Anna knows about your situation, Casper, so... Yeah, she only knows that I'm not stupid. So what, are you both gonna play down? An arm. Uh, probably we'll just not mention it. I just, um... Oh, it's right here. Here we go. This is the the first river that leads us right through. All right. Uh, pause here for a second, everyone. Okay. So, Casper, I think the idea should be just saying that you know Midas is a new friend of yours, and just keep it at that. Say that they're a Marigoldian. You know, tons of Marigoldians are new and about and about uh, maybe even here. So. I might just leave it at Midas as an old friend because new friend just doesn't sound right. But, yeah. My Midas is just an old friend that I used to work with. Okay. Sure. Good enough. Okay, just so we know, that's the story we're going with. Yep. Okay. Midas is an old friend. A, what, lab partner? Work partner? Like, what? Sure. We're just an old... We just used to work together. Okay. I guess. Sure. I think it's used now at this point. Okay. Um, Past tense. Simon says once we get to this little river bank here, it's just a little bit uh, ahead of us. So let's keep moving for boating. All right. I'm sorry that all of this happened so suddenly. I wasn't uh, expecting that. Should be a dock up here. There it is. And hey, the sun's setting soon, so that means the party's about to happen. We are on time. We're here, Melody. Um, I'll take our boats with us. Careful of the cold water. Hypothermia sets oh, in quick. Oh yeah, quick. Casper, did you see this? I got a new uh, halberd. That is awesome. Yeah. Did um, we make it? Yeah, Julie. Yeah, how'd, how'd you know? Uh, I've I've seen just through the windows a little bit of her work sometimes. So. Yeah, I, I've I've seen her work before, and this is uh, extraordinary. Hold on. Yeah. My, uh, there we go. Cool. I'm ready. And uh, don't worry. I haven't. I haven't forgotten about this. Oh so uh, yeah. You. Yeah. Yeah. I hope it helps you out at um, some point. From here, I'm not actually sure. Let me bring the lantern. Um. Okay. Through here, I think we might be a little late. It's still five minutes or so. Yeah, the sun is setting. Found it. It's just this way. Perfect. Simon was right. Yep, there it is from what I... I heard we were supposed to go towards that, the, the wing statue thingy. It's supposed to be a memorial. Melody, you good, huh? Well, as memorials go, they're not so bad. I can't hear you. Okay. We're just nodding? Okay. Fine. Here we are. Did you guys go up? Oh, you guys went up. Hi. Um, oh, dang. Oh. That's a steep drop. Oh? Up here, Melody. I got stuck here. What? Oh. Are you okay? Yeah, Good. we're trying to get around. Oh, it's right here. 
There we go. Just climb, climb up a little. Okay, it's pretty well lit here. That was possibly one of the most difficult paths we could have taken. Yeah, um, I was hoping we would come from like over there or something, but Simon's get Oh, look, and on Simon. Oh hey. And MBS and others. Hello. Hey guys. Hi. How's Hi. it going? Um, Hi. I think we got here just in time, right? The, the party you said yeah, yeah. you said it was going to be when the sun goes down. Why be? Yeah, around, around this time. Hey. Yeah. Don't hey, worry, buddy. How are you doing? Hi. Good. How are you? Hey, I got that thing created for you. Right. Yeah. 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 We have a present for you, YB. We have a present. Oh. So, Hi, yeah. MBS. Hi, Rain. Ciao. Says B. Hi. Hi. Ciao. Ciao. Hello. Hi. Okay, so, uh, it took a couple of nights to work on this. It was really difficult, but this, as long as you have this on you, you should be warmer than anyone here. Oh, what the heck? Uh -huh. Yeah. Sourced directly from Anna's fire. It's eternal. As long as you have it, it'll always keep you warm. Wow, that's Thank you. quite the experiment. Nice. Yeah. Well, it's we remember the vibe was, was very cold on. last time we saw it, yeah. so um, I know it. Uh, I just wanted to yeah, give it this. Yeah, I know it came all bundled up, so hopefully you're not too hot with all that. I mean, it should. I think it should adjust to the temperature. Huh. All right. So it's quite simple, really. You know, capturing an eternal flame inside a vessel that's heat resistant, keep causing the user to be warm. It's really just simple science. We know you're a genius. Obviously. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kind of a genius, but um, hey, that's uh, besides the point. So our group is just us, really. It's just Melody and me, YB, uh, Casper, uh, and then Casper's friend. Oh. Well, we've only hello. seen Rain and BS. And hey. then, hello. We want to see Rain and MBS, and then Puffer is running around somewhere, um, oh, but we haven't here. talked to him yet. But we have not seen anyone else. I don't know if anyone else is coming. All right. Um, well. But yeah, you guys, we can, we can we can just go up, I guess, to the main area. All right. Uh, you lead the way. Like if anyone, yeah, of course. Let's let us let us go. Yeah, if I've anyone not... else is coming, they can find their way. Yeah, I've not been here before, so I've been really excited to see uh, what Aspis looks like. Yeah. Same. I oh, hope you like right. it. I forgot that you've never really been here. Jay, you want to see something that I've been working on? Simon, you say that to me every time I tell you that I haven't seen your stuff and that I'm eager to see what you've been working on. <laughs> Listen, I... Too. This, Jay, is different. It's my... Well, frankly, it's my pride and joy. Yeah, guys. Welcome to Astros. Wow. Wow. This is it's impressive. Amazing. Really. And there's a castle in the sky. Oh yeah. Uh, it's yeah. Don't worry about that one. It's a prison. Um, oh. Okay. Moving, moving, oh. On. <laughs> moving on. Moving oh, on. Oh, looks a lot more majestic than it really is. Trust me. Yeah, we have we, we have a map of the town right here. If anybody gets lost. Um, I think I tried to mark everything on it. So, uh, if you guys direct your attention towards the right side of the town here, where the stage, the cafe, and the roller coaster is, that's where we'll be hosting most of the festivities, and that's where the New Year's party is going to commence. Do you have a roller coaster? Yeah, here? that's like right down here. Yeah, we have a roller coaster. coaster. It even works in the winter. Wow. Um, <laughs> so the only roller coasters I've ever seen have always been like abandoned or destroyed. I've never actually actually been on one. That's I, I didn't think they were around anymore. <laughs> okay. You've never been on the oh. one that I built next to Jan. Uh, no, I don't think I ever got around to it. Oh. Well, you have time to really relax and enjoy yourselves here today. So the roller coaster will be available. Yeah. <laughs> I, okay, I wasn't expecting that. That's, well, I think we needed a change of pace from Marigold. Or anyway, Yeah, well, really. uh, go ahead and feel free to explore, Jay. I would like to show you what I was working. Sure. Do, you, do we want to do a tour around Aspis first, or you just want to go... Oh, hi, Sesame. Uh, are we just going to go uh, right to it? 
Well, I was thinking that Anna could lead the rest of the guys on a little tour, and I can show you what I was working on. Something sure. I think you'd be impressed about. Yeah, yeah okay. Give the rest of the tour to Jay specifically after you're done. And okay. then come find uh, us. Mel, do you want to come with? Probably going to be in the be festivities area. Why, but you going to tag along? Do you want to come uh, with? If you want me to. I'm down. Okay. All right. If you're talking, I cannot hear you. Some cake out there, Tom. Uh oh. Oh. Maybe. In the meantime, Jay, just... are you not freezing in the suit? Huh? Are you not freezing in the suit? Um, I mean, it's warmer here, but. Yeah, I, okay? I wore a suit. Yeah, we're fine. Melody and I, we okay. might have overdressed, but. Uh... We didn't bring our winter no, no, clothes no, just in case. No, fine. I'm also I I also overdressed, I guess, but like. You guys overdress? I just put on whatever is available. I mean, it's not often I just oh, wear a really? whole suit. I guess I don't know. I've just been wearing like a jacket. I've always wear a suit. I mean, it you look good in a while, suit, but um, I was just suit. worried if you're freezing or not. Yeah, no, no, no. I'm good. I'm good. It is a lot warmer okay. here, so that's nice. Yeah. Um. Okay. Good Melody time. will tag along. We can go check out what you want to show me. All right, well, All right. I'm going to bring YB, Melody, and Jay. Anna, do me a favor, mm -hmm. show the rest of the guys around. Of course. All right, fantastic. Uh, guys, enjoy your time here. Don't get into any trouble. Sorry. Good luck, everyone. <laughs> Go. We're going to be don't fine. say it like that. Yeah, why do you say it like that? <laughs> me. What do you mean? Don't listen to him. He's being a goober again. Go. I'm f I'm just I'm just saying. Oh. All right, Simon, take us where you want to take us. Uh, we'll see the rest of you guys later. Yes, All right. Yeah. Take care, uh, see you later. Bye. All right. So, um, probably split so up. from this point. All right, guys. Okay. We are away. Are we going to your lab? Yes. Yay. Have you been there before, Flavi? Once or twice. Oh. Jeez. So this is huge. Office, he says it's dangerous. <laughs> hey, guys. I hope you're not afraid of heights. Uh. No. Fantastic. Then this shouldn't be much of an issue. If you guys can, you know, pass the door. Yeah. Um, down there? Easily. Follow me? Yeah. Uh, do you want to go first? Okay. Hey! Ooh, okay. My stomach dropped Welcome. just for a second, but that's alright. Welcome to the Deep Labs. This wow. is my pride and joy. It's uh, remarkable. Wow. And I thought I had a cool it's underground facility. Um... It's everything that we could have ever wanted and more. And it's no all uh here. Everything is fine here. Here, contained, protected, and of course created by me. And it won't let and me touch anything. You can't touch anything. So this is what no you've way. been up to for the last three to four months, huh? Building yeah, all this? It's kind of been my passion project of course i wasn't the one that built it i'm not that crazy uh, i've got construction workers top workers on this place but i assure you everything is secure safe and relatively accident free uh-huh how many days since your last accident uh so here's where the memory machine room is now oh yeah you did move it out of your old house yeah it's it's not working but i'm working on fixing it uh, I've got a bit of an issue with it, but once I work out the kinks, something happened during the move, everything will be fine. Okay, well, happy to see you working on it again. I remember how happy you were when you first got it working back in Marigold, so I'm yeah, glad I mean, you... It was this thing that really pushed my, sh uh, my inventor in me out, being able to make something like this, it's... Anyway, enough about my accomplishments. Over here is a small mm -hmm. workshop. That's uh, like one of those things light. in Asphodel, right? Yeah, 
I've been studying it. Its power is unstable. Don't those oh. things explode? Yeah. So don't touch it. I understand now why you won't let me touch anything. Um, just through here. You're not gonna huh. understand much of anything here, what but this is a little safe haven of mine. Jesus. This is a this is what we call a 3D printer. Uh, this thing helps me work on a lot of the projects that I have. And huh. you also have the also standard Asphus calendar, huh? We got them in Marigold now too. Yeah. Hmm. Funny. All right, but yeah. Come with me. Jesus. So Watch what? Your head. So what do you study in here, Simon? Everything that I can get my hands on. What's your most recent? Well, my most recent is the project that I was working with. Well, I mean, now let me show you something. Um, the disinfected thing doesn't work just yet, but it's fine. There's nothing in here We're that's too adjacent. dangerous. Clean adjacent. So here is my personal lab where I've been working on most of my projects, and here is my biggest breakthrough. What you're looking at is a self-sustaining power source mined from a very, very deep cave. I have not, I have yet to find any more of what it is. It looks very similar to another crystal that exists here, but this is different. It's what I uh, made the vessel that contains the fire that YB's holding right now. It's weird how it's just floating like that. It's remarkable. It has been my obsession as of late. This thing, this crystal, is capable of crazy things. Its output energy is insane if I could just contain it. But that's besides the point. Uh, this is my little lab. Uh, everything and anything I'm working on is usually through here. Here's some microscopes where I'm studying plants. The tubes are filled with a, uh, specific, a specific liquid that empowers you and quickens you, and this is a laser. Just don't don't go don't go near it. That don't touch the laser. It, 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 yeah, will probably. it cut my hand off? No, it's not that kind of laser. It's harmless, but it, it's it, stop, stop. Get, why, get. why be careful? <laughs> Melody, you ready? So that little area that you just came out of is what my weird testificates are calling the Psy Labs. I, I don't get it. Over here... I mean, that's what people is... used to call you, no? Now people here call you that too? Nah, they call it as in like a short form assignment, like SI. You're talking as if YB and I didn't know you back when you went by that name. I know, I'm just saying they call it by my name. I don't, I don't, I don't get it. I, I yeah, no, nah, I, I, I get it. So here is, don't go in here, don't touch it, don't look at it, forget it exists. This is the vault. What I contain in there is things that I'd rather not people have, you know, their eyes on. There's nothing in it yet, but it's not meant for people to Every just time you tell me it. not to look at it, I look at it even harder. Okay? Yeah, you should not do that, though. Okay, um, all those lava channels, you got cameras everywhere well what are the lava probably... what is the lava power the lava is uh well you don't really have to see it i could just hide it it's uh it's for uh heat source related stuff ah. but i wanted it to be glass because it looks so cool anyway so that's what it's keeps the... asphus a bit warmer huh yeah sorta it's one of the reasons all that lava is channeled in between every single part of the town and further. This is my section. So here is the break room. This is where testificates, workers, and of course, me, relax sometimes. Uh, where did Melody go? Uh, Melody's just kind of staring. They're lost. Let's She's fine. Down. She's fine. Here. Uh... Hey, Melody. Hi. And now, let me just show you one last thing, and I'll let you guys get on your way. It's all really impressive, Simon. I, I'm really impressed. You said I would, and it I is, am. I know. This is... 
I mean, it's it's everything that I could have ever wanted. All here. Safe. And and I've and I've tested everything. Everything is fine. It's not gonna be like in Marigold. It's I've got terrains from places like the underworld and just up here is my little cave, my little piece of passion, and you're in my chair already. Yeah. So this is the overseer's office. This and on this thing that is huh. computer. Um, That's cute. Ooh, you got kissing on your computer. Yeah. All right, listen. Uh, through that computer, I'm able to watch the cameras all around the town, and sometimes I stand over here to just overlook the facility. It's quite the view, really. That really does change you. And just through here is my personal workshop and where I will be conducting all of my augment related things, inventions, and you're again in my chair. Yeah. <laughs> so over here is my foundry, my forge where I invent and create some of the tools that I make. Here's my medical chair where I will implant things into people or myself. Books about medical stuff. This is my personal little area. Huh. Really, uh, that's, homey. That's about it. There is one last thing, and I think you'll be really happy about this one, Jay. Oh, yeah? I don't want to keep you guys too long. I know the festivities are in order, but... There is one last thing that I want to show off. Something that I am truly impressed about. Something I think you'll get a kick out of. Well, I mean, color me impressed already. I don't know how it can get better than this. It's really uh, well, inspired me to do something similar in Marigold. Yeah, I don't know if you can pull off something as crazy as what you see here, but uh, you can try. I mean, are your workers contractable? Yeah, they're test certificates after all. They're helpers, scientists, some of the greatest minds work here. Hmm. Maybe I'll uh, so chat with Anna about that. Or you. Over here is our, uh... Probably the best part of this little place. I am so tired of everything always going wrong all the time. So this is what I made to compensate for this. Where's White? Down here... Where is one? I find Jazz. Where are you? What? Uh, back at the thing. I'm coming. Yeah, they're pretty far back. We've kind of left them behind. Why me? Get over here. Which over? Back down to the entrance. Okay, I can go there. I know where that is. Why? Oh, Jazz. Hello. What? Hi. Hey, uh, oh, the ghost is, is back? Yeah. Don't worry, they're uh, fine. I can tell you that. I don't like it. Oh, Didn't knowing this place. Just don't. Whatever. If you're listening to me right now, ghost, don't come down here and freak me out, okay? Just don't. I think anyway, you should come down here and freak him out. You should not. No, I'll be nice. So here oh. is what I built to compensate. It's not done yet, but I built it to compensate for everything that's ever gone wrong in Marigold. This is what I'm calling the bunker. It is hundreds and hundreds of floors of rooms and rooms and rooms all built to hold hundreds and hundreds of people in the event of catastrophic failure. Explosives, followers, doesn't matter what it is, where it happened, people can move down here to be absolutely safe. Nothing can touch them down here. And of course, it's all roomy. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. She means well. She says hi. Yeah. Well, I don't. I don't. You know, listen. I don't. I don't fuck with ghosts. Okay. They freak me out. Okay. Well, one day you'll be able to see she's jazz. She's so mean. And... She's right here. I'm sorry. You're probably really cool. I just. It, I. I. I'm not scared. I just don't like ghosts. Okay. Well, hey, I gradually saw Jazz over time. I wasn't the first, like, Melody or YB. Maybe in time you'll see Jazz, too. Maybe. Maybe you'll be less scared. So that's the Deep Labs. Of course, it's ever-expanding, ever-growing, and becoming even more secure than it already is, but 
for now, that's all we got. It's remarkable, Simon, really. I'm, I'm astonished, impressed. I mean, you said it yourself, I would be, so... So, if you cannot find me, and want to find me, I'll most likely be here, up there, working on projects. Awesome. Well... And one of these days you'll make a project that I can mess around with. And one of these days I'll make something that you can mess around with. But... Didn't you just get something from Simon YB? Maybe you can mess around with that. Yeah. But yeah. That's just uh, I made it YB or... proof. That's, that thing is not going to break or crack or anything. It is made out of that crystal that I was just talking about. In a right. very refined and molecule formed. It is quite literally like a tightly woven crystal. That thing ain't breaking. Even if YB chucks it at something. Which I know you're going to try eventually. No. Try not to break Simon's things, YB. So how do you feel? How does it work? Warm to the touch. I feel... I feel cozy. <laughs> ah, I love the sound of a project going right. Anyway, let's go get on out of here. I'm sure you guys want to reach the rest of the crew. Uh, let's go check it out. Jazz, are you able to go through that? I'll be fine. Okay. Ugh! Always hated that part. Yeah, that'll take some getting used to. Ugh. Better than stairs, though. And that, I'll stick by. You guys want a snack? There's yeah. no snakes in there, but... What? Yeah, I, I know. And why did you cookies? I, there will be cookies soon. Just, just check back. Cookies. Okay, so the others are... Pers wow, it's getting late. The others are presumably already at the festival area, if I'm not mistaken. I, I'm not too sure. Would Probably. you guys like to go? Yeah, sure. I'm going to try my best to navigate there, but most of the time I'm cooped up in my lab, so I don't have time to learn the layout. You've been here for months. You still haven't figured it out? Uh, you'd be surprised on how little I actually come out here. <laughs> I feel like at this point I know this place. Yeah, didn't we go that way? Uh, the windmill, right? Oh, yeah. It is this way. Towards the giant firebird. Oh, that's what that is. Huh. Yeah. Asphus is very uh, colorful. Looks not colorful. really nice. Asphus is beautiful. Yeah. That too. This town, this city, these people, oh. all of them, oh. all of them make me oh. forget about all the things that happened back in Miracle. With all due respect, I just... I'm happy here. I mean, I wince every time you say it, but I mean... Alright, I just got sticky keys. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Look, everyone else is here. Um, Hi. Hi. Uh, Jay, we are talking with Ku privately. Whoops. <laughs> Did they get in here? Or what? Hi, everyone. Hello. Hello. Hi there, guys. Hi, Ace. How are you doing? Hi. Hi, B. Um, Hi. Not, not, not Hi. the best. Right? Yeah. Cool. Nice. It's been a bit, man. It's been yeah. a bit. How are hey. you doing? Hi, Ace. Uh, uh, what's that blue right. right here on your nose? Mm, um, that is just some blue ice, you know? Like actual ice? Get that. Yeah, it's like gold. Aren't you, aren't you a demon? Yeah, I I don't I don't give off like more heat than most people just because I'm a demon. It's more of a I just live in a really hot place, so my mm. body is used to hotter temperatures. Would you like to come back to my lab soon? Um, I, I think I think we still have some more time before the actual New Year's kicks off, oh, right? Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah. So Melody and I are gonna go sit down for a few minutes, um, but we're gonna go check out what's over there. You should try to oh. roll our coaster. I'm sure, we'll give it it some, I'm sure we'll give it a shot. I, yeah. It had some technical issues again, but I fixed it. Yeah, we what fixed it. Technical issues. We unclogged it. Technical issues, but I fixed it. I ran that course like 40 times. How could it have technical issues? What happened? Yeah, I, all right, everyone. We'll, we'll, we'll move on through. We'll see you all again soon. Yeah. yeah. 
Um, there might have just been a few extra. Hey, you feeling okay? Please pick me up. Please pick me up. Is it picking me? Yes, I hear you. I heard you. Oh, I'm sorry, honey. <laughs> you want to go sit down somewhere and just chill out? No, I'm not going to leave you. Come on. We'll go find some place to sit. Um, that map said one of these spots is a library. Maybe that's the library? That looks like a library. Do you want to sit in there? Or, oh, maybe this... What is this, like a restaurant? There's that roller coaster. Uh, where would you where would you like to sit? Okay. Let's go sit in the library. Maybe we'll get a little bit warm. Wow. It's, uh... Reminds me a lot of the Marigold library, but just kind of the other way. You know how, like, it kept stretching backwards? This one's, like, with the width, you know? Here's somewhere to sit down over here. Bunch of books here. Here, we can sit here. Let's just sit down and take a break, okay? I know it's a little much, but don't worry. I'll be right here with you. I love you.
All right. You ready to start heading out? Yeah, I guess so. Okay. We just took some time to ourselves. It's going to be okay. I, I think we might have overdressed, and that's why we're just too cold. I feel fine. It's just a lot. I, yeah, I know. Well, might as well see what everyone else is up to now. If we can find them. Uh-huh. In this large city. Really large city? Mm-hmm. Just, it's gonna be okay. Just try to take a couple of breaths, okay? I'll be right here, and if you need me, just hold my hand again, and we'll go away somewhere together, okay? Okay. Also, I hope you're not actually wanting to go on the roller coaster, but if you are, I will do it with you. Okay, let's no not do it. No way in hell. No way in hell. Let's not do it. I've never done it before, and I don't think I plan on it. Me neither. Why are you Simon? What are they doing over there? I don't know What's if happening? I want to know. You have a lot of background noise, by the way. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Like, like I could stream? hear a car going by. Oh, yeah, I think there's cars here in Asphus. Well, let's see what these people are up to here. And kids screaming now. Well, yeah, it's Asphus. Let's hop the VC. That's call. true. Joy! Where's your what wonder? Is, what are you hey, talking about? This what is not, what is like, going on here? Or the new game. Game. We're having some fun. I made a gang. The oh, Rims here too. Made a gang. I made a gang. We're the land fish. We are. I know you're a fish. I know Jazz is a fish. <laughs> oh, there's Jazz. No, we're all the land fish. Jazz, why don't you join us? You should join us. Um, we're having fun. Hey guys, I think I'm uh, to. There's a ghost. Oh, we're all inclusive. We're uh, what? We take fish, non-fish, Never heard of ghost, jazz? Ghost fish. No. You guys never bitch, heard of jazz? Yes. Yes. You know, some people I have. Bitch, are you a hallucination bag? I uh, literally talk to yeah. anyone no, else here. No, no, jazz, jazz oh, is real. Gang, apologies. Yeah. Oh, jazz, jazz is very real. real. Jazz is 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 I oh, look there at you that. go. She looked there you go. Oh, look at that. Oh, Hello, Jazz. Oh my Hello, God. I I hey, Jazz, I always give you a little bit of food. Again. Here you go. That bread does not look good to eat. It's garlic. No, that's bread. garlic bread. Uh, Come on. Or so I was told. Mine is blue. Any. Well if it's anything that comes oh, from there or anything like that, I don't want to trust it. I look Man, like from Sai Simone's ghost. Oh, so, uh, and it's running. We just went to go get warm at the library real quick. What has everyone been up to? We've just been running around? We made a gang. Around. We made a gang. I brought a lot of stuff with me. The one thing I didn't bring was a clock. I don't even know what time it is. Yeah. It's, it's approximately... Uh, I love how everyone just moon, looked so up. I'm not entirely sure. It's, it's like, I don't really even know how late it is based on where the moon is. Yeah, no, I don't see the moon. It's over there. It's over yonder. It's right over there. Right over there. Mm, oh, well, it's where? Uh, uh, I was behind the building. I would say somewhere between 7 and 8. I think it's 10. Oh, is it rising? I think it's 10. I don't believe that. 10, maybe. I'm okay. not terribly sure. I think it's 6 in the morning. It is it's nearing the morning. Yeah? Sun. What's uh, up? Yep. All right, all right, everybody. Happy late New Year's if it's 6 in the morning. Five, yeah. Uh, I don't think it's 6 in the morning. Three. Yeah, I think it's more like... Where's Ace? We need more two, game. Two, one. In the evening. Happy New Year's. Seven, where were you soon? <laughs> is it New Year's already? No, uh, I don't no, think so. Barely. I don't, I don't so. think it is. Well, I think I it think is it for another it's hour. The moon, the moon, you you believe it? Uh, New Year's. Only a couple weeks Ooh. away. No, it's about an hour it's away, very, I would very say. Far down. Oh. Yeah, I think we're still a little off. Um, Five, four. No. Uh, no, no <laughs> way. Yet. What quite. are you counting down for? New Year. If you start Wait, by what? like. Th it's the New Year's. What we, did you yeah, know that's, what, that's why we're that, here. That, that's, that's the party. Wait, I thought it was just a party. No, it's the New it's Year's party. You, you know, the year right now is 2005, right? Well, no, I didn't. Oh, oh, dear. Dear. Okay, listen. So the year, yeah, the year lasts like a couple hundred days, a right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, you came up to the surface in 2005. When it becomes midnight, it'll be 2006. What? That's crazy. I know so it probably doesn't make any sense to you, but I'll believe so that you think it's crazy. It, 
Is Raina... So New Year's just... Raina's not from where person. we're from. Uh, Rain's from Yeah, I'm down, from underground. Yeah, downtown. Like, underground oh, city. Awesome. I've heard tales. Yeah. Also, yes, Everyone died also? there. Oh, I guess Wanna I need come to with? update yeah. the anthology of tales. Yep. Oh, apologies. Yeah. Hey, what's, okay. uh, what's going on? Um, listen. You know that Reggie character? Yeah. The yeah, one. I explained this to YB a second ago, but, um, Reggie told Ku that Ku should bring a sword to the event, a weapon. I'm worried that something is going to go wrong. Who's bringing a weapon so, to the event? Who, but not out of, like, anger, out of, like, protection. Ku? Who thinks that something might go wrong? I think something might go wrong. So I'm telling you, and I told YB, to stay vigilant. Because I don't want anything to happen. Listen, I I trust Ku. I've been spending a lot of time with him, you know, these last few months. You know, he's been very isolated, but, you know, not a lot of people talk to him. I think he's just a little bit misunderstood, okay? No, I, I trust Ku, too. Uh -huh. That is exactly why I'm telling you that. Okay, well, I have my halberd. I have a pickaxe. I have a sword. I have God a bow. Damn. We we okay. boated here, dude. You showed us how to get here anyway. We have what I didn't want to take any risk. I was traveling with YB Melody Casper and its new friend. I don't want to take any I chances. Know. I'm just old friend. A day. Old friend. I don't want this to be a repeat of everything that's happened in Mirror. I told YB the same thing. Just be vigilant. Keep your eyes peeled. Okay. If anything you think is weird, let me know. Simon, please. Okay? I get it. You don't like Marigold. You don't have to rub it in my face every time. I will remain vigilant. I I usually am, yeah, and I know you know this. Just please leave, leave Marigold out of this, okay? We're trying okay. to make it better. I get that you're trying to, you know, but what happened happened, okay? I'm not happy about it, and I'm trying to make it different here. I'm, I'm sorry that I keep bringing it up, but it's just the truth. It's not going to happen here. I won't let it. I don't think Ku's gonna do something stupid. I don't think anyone would do something. I don't think Ku's gonna do something stupid. I think something is gonna happen. Maybe the followers are back. Maybe explosives are gonna sit off again. I don't know. I no. looked under the stage. You looked under the stage, and what was there? Explosives or what? Nothing. A trapdoor? Nothing. Okay, nothing. Not a thing. Does Anna think we should be worried, or are you are the one worrying? Anna knows about it too. I know that Anna is capable to deal with anything. That's why I'm least worried about Anna. Because if somebody tries to hurt Anna, Anna's more strong than most people I know. It's the people in the crowd I'm worried about. Who specifically? Do you have any suspicions? No. I don't know anything. I'm completely clueless. I'm just scared. Jay, I'm shaking, okay? it's. I'm starting to remember things that happened back then. and I, And I'm tired of it. I just want things to go differently this time. Okay, and things will go differently. This, what happens here tonight won't be like Marigold. Man, I sure hope so. I'm just... There's a lot I'm of people sorry, just, like, I'm, just I'm, walking around, sorry. I'm just scared. Okay, Jay, uh, I'm scared. <laughs> you... You don't have to be, like, uh, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just a little upset that we're still thinking about this stuff. No one's seen Richie in months, and I want to believe that things are okay. It's just... I do too, man. I want more than anything to forget that everything happened. And and, 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 and the, the lab, and then me and Anna, and everything is so happy. I'm happy. I'm For the first time in my life, I'm happy. And then I'm worried about this. And I'm, I'm just... I'm happy for you. I just... I'll stay on guard, Okay. Thank you. If if I'm if I'm needed, I have a weapon. I'm not using it for anything stupid. It's protect. Okay. It's to protect Melody, YB, Casper. You know, we weren't gonna That's walk to the forest. Hey, Casper. Hey, Casper. Hi, Casper. Sorry. Do you guys know where Anna is? I haven't seen I her since we left earlier. Found something. Found what, what kind of something? Um. A pathway that suspiciously has multiple vantage points Anna's at right the there. stage, and also... Anna's right over there. Oh, wonderful. Okay. Uh, I need oh. to... Sorry. Uh, I need to talk to Anna about this. This is... This is good. Um... Dude! What? 
exactly what I'm talking about. You want to go check on it? Of course I want to go check on it. Okay, let's check on it. What, what do you think is wrong? I don't know. I'm... S Everything's okay. Yeah. Oh, is cool. everything okay? Yeah. Hi, cool. Sorry yeah. to interrupt you guys. I, um, a couple of us were just having a grand old time, and we found something, and I think you might want to know about it. What? Um, you're able to go in water, aren't you? Uh, yes. I'm fine. What? This is what we found. A pathway that suspiciously has multiple vantage points at the stage, and also uh, an escape cool. point right above, like right on the cliff above the stage. That would be a heck of a good place to kill someone from. So, I'm thinking, I don't know if this was meant to be used today or some other day, but I don't like it. That it is. wasn't there yesterday or the head of my guard's light to me. Awesome. Yeah, it it what comes out up here. Hell? Right. Okay, so right we've got a bit of a breach, Simon. What what do you propose we do then? I'll help you. What hey, YB. Hey, Puffer. What There's I propose... nobody here. Yeah. Uh, I just... Uh, we're I not I'm sorry. I thought that you might want to know. Yeah, thank okay. you. Thank you for the information, Casper. Um, Anna. Okay, wait. What? We're sealing it. We're... No. Oh, the, the, the just pathways? Yeah. Yeah. The I don't want to end the event. Think... I'm worried now. It's okay. There was nobody inside. Nobody can get inside because there are people all around. Anna, with all due respect, respect you're pathways. talking about a breach that apparently your guards didn't tell you about. If someone was worried, I'll help him fix it. Just tell us what you want us to do. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm reach. I'm just, closing. And the I know Ku would help too, right? Ku. Okay, we need to just seal the pathways. That, also hide Well, I mean, just entrances and exits of this. And then I suppose we can just go and check if there's anything suspicious around. But who would even do that? Exactly what I was talking. There's only one person I know that us things like that and I don't think he would be there but... there okay no there there would be fine I I can't actually kind of expect there to be here there's Goodbye, completely isn't... fine what are you talking about and who are you talking I'm... about Richie no one's seen him for months I haven't seen him exactly exactly this is why I'm thinking that it's not him but like who would do that then I don't know it doesn't matter. We're gonna secure the breach, keep constant eye on behind the stage. Do we have okay. any guardsmen available? Oh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, they should be around the perimeter and near the castle. I just told them to not follow me. Um, okay, so if you go to the castle, if you go to the castle, you can find them in the towers, I think. Here's what we're gonna do. Here's the here's the situation. Me and Jay are gonna secure the seal, the breach. We're gonna seal the breach. And then I'm going to have the guardsmen take post behind the, up there, mm -hmm. behind the stage, keep out of sight, and make sure that if anything goes wrong, they can talk to me on my headset. And I will okay. immediately spring into action. Okay, okay. We, we might need a bit more than just you and me for this. Uh, Puffer, are you yeah. good to do something? Yeah, yeah, okay. of course. And, and Ku? I trust you both. Yeah. Okay, the four of okay. us will go check I'll... this out, okay? Yeah, I'll keep okay, watch around here and make sure that everyone yeah. is, you know. You guys stay here, okay? Alright, stay warm too. Right, right. Stay safe, everyone. <sighs> I'm freezing. Anyway. It's gonna get colder, man. Yeah. It's whatever. It's fine. Okay. Where do you propose we go first, then? The four of us. Well, we're gonna take a little dip in the water and see just uh, where this whole thing leads. Uh, real, real quick. YB, uh, I think Melody just went off to use the bathroom. Just let her know that I'm gone, okay? Okay, Jazz, you too, whatever. We'll be over here. Okay. Alright. Alright, All right. so, so... We're gonna go in here? We're gonna, do. we're gonna go... Ooh, in here. I'll be perfect for this. Yeah, I, I'd rather uh -huh. not... I'm not dressed warm enough for that. 
Oh, just get in. I am not going to the water. It's fine. I will speed Puffer got this. Okay. All right. Where, is there a way we re where can we meet you? On we're going to find yeah. out where this ends and then I'm going to come up there. Probably above the stage from what, from what we know. Okay. So let's, let's go to the stage. Let's go to the stage. Yeah. Uh, very... Pretty long tunnel. Very familiar stage. Oh, that's fucked up. Are you doing okay, Ku? I came to see you the other day, but you weren't there or you weren't answering the door. Uh, what, what day was this? Um... 28th? I meant to come see you the 27th, but I didn't see you around. I must have just not heard you. Not cut the door. Oh, or... there you are. Stop. Is this it? Yeah. The what hell? the fuck is this? I got keeping hole? I can't even get in from, from here. There's like... I'm like Hold stuck. Hold on. Look up. What? Where are you? Up? Above you, behind. What? Where am I looking? Look up at the over here. Oh, there. Oh, how? You were just below Wait, the ground. What? How fast is that tunnel? It leads Quick. Up directly up to the top of this mountain. It's got multiple people surrounding the area around the the stage. This maybe is try exactly blocking them out. Because like, if maybe if someone tried to enter, it'd be better to like, just block off the entrances, so it'd be harder for them to enter if there's someone. I don't, I don't have any blocks. Maybe here. we can fill it up with some gravel or sand. We can muster up. I'm gonna, uh, yeah, I'm gonna fill a good chunk with it. Uh, me and Puffer are gonna fill it up with a little bit of dirt on the entrance and the uh, exit. Okay, maybe we w might want to cover up the pond too, and whatever this hole over here is. I can't even get to it from here, which Wait, means I don't think this is where I saw Simon poke his head out. It's right in there. I saw him. Alright. Um, are you I sure you didn't just hear a reflection? No, come here. Look. Look where I'm looking, oh. right there. It's an indent. Oh. Look. Hey, guys. Oh. That's yeah, what I'm afraid is, of. And you and I can't get in from there, so I, I don't understand. I don't know anything don't know about Anna's guards and, and what they report to Anna. A direct view to here. Also. I don't like that at all. That looks too much like an oh, assassination it's an easy way out, kind too. of. This is exactly uh, what I was telling I mean, you, Bud Shay. This is what I was I, worried about. I don't like wait, that angle at all. Wait, I, I could try and cover it up if you're fine with me breaking a few things, though. I mean, I don't own Asphus. An Anna does, and you're still close with Anna, right? Maybe she'll forgive right, you. So here's what we're going to do, Puffer. We're going to make all sure right. that this whole thing is sealed. Grab Let me see this. Cobblestone. Can I... Oh, okay. There. Just... It I don't like looks that at all. A bit more okay, we covered up the we covered up the breach that leads up onto the stage. All right, okay. it looks we're gonna start covering up this now, whole thing. But it's fine. I don't know if there's anything else here. It makes me wonder if how many other the little caves or entrances there could be. Uh, Somebody have, has been spying on us. I think or is more than that. To spy on us? Someone that's obviously gone in past Anna's reports or whatever reports Anna was saying that her guards put through her. Someone didn't. Clearly that mentioned is. this part. I don't know who that is. Who? Where? Oh, Somebody so in blue. Somebody in diamond armor in here. I think it's Ram. No. <sighs> what is Ram doing? Oh, they've probably been sent to help us out. I don't see any more people. Hi, Anna. You guys are right? Yeah. Ram? No, we discovered yeah, we something. Looking over at the, there is a hole the here. Peephole. There is a peephole. Puffer and yeah, Simon found it, but went to the pond. Here. There was one right here. here. It didn't look yeah, good, so we covered it up. Yeah, there was one here, and there is another one over here. Wait, where? Three like, separate people. behind what? the line. The right there. Okay, the one right if it's there. just for one. There's another yeah, one here, here, Simon. It's here. How'd you see- how'd you guys see this? Yo, uh, guy. I went there. We just right here. happened to- you here. saw it? Okay, there are two- okay, there are two opportunities here, right? Oh, there is one here. Hey, look, look here. If you found the people, hey. there are two things yeah. that can happen. And are these one are... of them is that one the... okay, one of them is that it's actually a security breach, and the other one is that you were right and it's there, but then it's completely harmless. Oh, that oh. was harmless? I mean we can there, just there, cover there it is up. not gonna do anything to me. Not to you right now, at least. To us. There I don't believe that for a second. Anything. I don't trust that for a second. And clearly, this isn't just There's one security there. breach like that pond. Look, this is this is a few I, of them. 
Bear and I have been chatting I counted for three. quite some time, and he's fine, and we are fine. And yes, I know you two he's get along. Good advice. Yes. And yeah, he would not blow up the stage or anything. We're talking about the if same there who publicly because... killed someone just so he could get some money of it. We're talking about the same person who killed and pushed Acedonia to yeah, the fucking void. Man. Yeah, we are talking about that there, and I don't feel good about it either, Inner. And if Simon doesn't feel about it, wh how do you feel about that? And this isn't just this one security Simon breach. They are not on their best foot. On the best foot? There's a monster, Anna? There may be a monster, but he's not going to do anything to Anna. Neither is he going to do anything to this area. That you know of? What if that's exactly what you guys want to believe? He's that's like calling us fine. an idiot. He, okay. He's been giving me good advice and he's been just fine. Listen, Anna, I trust you. So here's what we're going to do. Like I'm this. going to double the security here. Everywhere. We're going to okay. keep him out of sight. We're going to put him in trees. I don't want anything to not be covered. Okay. Jersey, I'm talking please. every guardsman that we have. Okay? okay. We have less than a half an hour till midnight. Is that even enough time to even do something about it? To make sure that Anna is protected. I'm headed up to I'm the castle fine. right now. I'll be back in less than 20 minutes with an entire platoon. All right. Even if it's not there they and it's someone writing, else who's around. Fine. If it's someone else, then I mean, that's another concern. But and if they don't so target you, they'll target someone else that's visiting here. That's exactly why I'm glad you know Jay, because I'm gonna have you stand guard with the with the crowd. And Anna, watch over the crowd while I go grab the cards, the guardsmen. Okay? Well, Anna's speaking to the crowd. I'll be in the crowd. Yeah, I'll... but I need you. Well, you'll be in the crowd, and I'll see everything from here. So if everything happens, I'll also be able to react. And you'll be in the crowd, so everything in the crowd should be safe. And who's gonna be up and here, I... right? What? I'm gonna have Ku stationed up here with a sword. So you think I need a bodyguard? No, but I think somebody should be on the so uh, on the on the stage. Even if it's not okay. exactly a bodyguard okay. for you, just having some muscle appear with a weapon would be good enough to at least scare someone away, make them reconsider. Dude, can you do that for me? Okay. Can you watch over this stage area? Yeah, yeah. Okay, then we have okay. everything yeah. secured. I'm going up to the castle. Bubble Puffer, I'm go grab the guard. Hi, Puffer. Just hit up the crowd. Puffer. Okay, I need you on there too. Listen, I'll sit at I'll the watch. front of the I'll sit at the front of the crowd if you want to sit in the back, okay? I can sit in the back, yeah. Okay. Okay. And I gotta go. Good with I gotta go. Okay. You... okay. Stay works. safe, please. And I, I don't mean to upset you or anything or accuse there, but I'm telling you. I I wasn't thinking of anything until we saw the holes. If you saw what we saw, you'd be freaked out too. I don't want people I mean, to try to hurt you or anyone else. I understand what happened, That's but so I know Can we cover that? Do we have any more blocks? Me. Hang on. I don't know. <laughs> Look at these holes, Anna. I'm got a pumpkin. Hang on. I know. It's just. Do you remember in the hospital in Marigold? That works. She was just sitting in the in the walls and peeking through them and throwing bread at Sesby through them. Yeah. Remember when he worked with Richie? Work with Richie. He just let Richie go. He worked with Richie. That's what YB said when he attacked he Devil's Town. There's. Look, there is too smart to work with Richie. Why be said that there was there? It doesn't mean that he works with Richie. He knew Richie would attack. He was right with a couple feet away. I don't know. I think there is too smart to work with Richie. That's like saying that I worked with Richie when I let Richie go. And yeah, I was and I was go. once Richie's friend. He was one of the first Marigoldians ever. And you don't think I think of that every time that a terrorist was once my friend? <sighs> Look, there is not even here because if he was. He would talk to me. Okay. That you I know of. You have to understand where I'm coming from. I was looking forward to coming to Aspis today. I haven't I been here before. And I've been telling myself to be not on edge. But as soon as Simon starts telling me about things and now we're seeing holes, now I am on edge. I'm worried about your safety. Look, I'm worried about the people's but here's safety. You've got to understand where me and Anna are coming from, Jay. I'm trying to. But we're talking about their fucking Aswell here. And I don't want to th th think for a second that he can get th the hood hey. pulled over me. What? Hey, I got yeah. everyone posted up. They're in the trees. We got snipers all around the perimeter. Okay. Thank you, Simon. Look. I know that everything 
like I know that a lot happened with you and Air and Ace and everything, and I know that you all have your reasons to not trust him and stuff, but he also knows that this is very important to me, and I think I want to believe that he wouldn't mess it up for me. So either all of these peeping holes were just so that he could watch it in case he comes and he doesn't want to show up because, you know, there's a lot of people here who might not like him, or it was not him. I want to... I, I want to believe that he would not do it yeah, after that, everything that happened in the past three months. That makes the two of us. I want to believe it too. I, I, I'm trying to see where you two see it from, but... I know that he's not the best person, and I'm I'm not saying that he can be fixed or anything, I just... I just don't think there was... if it was him, I don't think there was any sort of intention of harm in it. I'm just I mean, upset. I understand that we need to... yeah, I'm, uh, trust me, I'm upset. But go on. I'm just upset that this is something we're worrying about. And whether or not it's there or not, I think I'm still a little angry that there didn't get any sort of repercussions. Uh, yeah, I know, but... Nobody's ever said a word. Not me. I don't have that kind of say anymore, and I don't want that say, but... Realistically. I'm not realistic, letting my guard down. Yeah. I'll do what I can. I'll sit in the front of the crowd, make sure people are protected, okay? Buffer will sit in the back, Ku will stay up here, and Simon will be with your guards. But, but this is just more, this is a bit more than a security breach with these amount of holes in a pond in the walls here right where you'd be standing that's something you're gonna have Look, to talk with your guards I'll the, talk to the guards after this is done and I'll talk to their next time I see him I'll write to him and I'll ask him to come and he probably will like last time I'll talk to him it should mm. be fine I think it's I think it's gonna be fine I don't think anything is gonna happen Fine. I'll... I'm gonna go talk to Melody. But what? Midnight should be in about 20 minutes, right? So, we're doing yeah, this soon. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Do you Every still want to say a few words, Jay? Uh, sure. Would yeah. you like to say a few words? Yeah, yeah. I wouldn't mind. I, I don't know if YB wanted to say anything. It might be best if you ask uh, YB first. Yeah, I will. I just know that you might have had something in mind. I'll ask YB. Okay. Uh, okay. You talk to uh, YB, I'll talk to Melody. Yeah, I got... We're, we're figure, we're... Every, every single person that I could get is on standby. They're just out of sight. Okay? Okay, yeah. We can still make this event a good one. Let's just calm down. We got 20 minutes till midnight. So yeah. in that 20 minutes, we're starting this. Whatever you have planned. Yeah. You talk to YB, and if YB doesn't want to say anything, I'll say a little something. But... Okay. I'll talk to YB. Okay. Yeah, I'll... Where is YB is the question? YB's blankly at staring at a wall right now. Yeah, oh. I think they're over by the teapot handle. Okay, I'll, 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 I'll go break. check. Hey, you okay? Casper. You wanna talk? Yeah. Hey, Casper. Over here. Sure. Hi. You wanna get on that stage? Anna offered it. She wanted to know if I wanted to say anything. And... No! I don't want to either. Did, what did you hear? Let's talk over here. Oh, the, you know, there's a security breach. Somebody could possibly die. Casper thinks it could be rain for some reason. Why rain? I don't know. I think it's there. Anna said that he said or would plan to be here, and he's not here. And the way that these spots are carved, it's perfect for just hiding. You know, poking his head out or something. There was a spot right there, underneath, uh, behind the glass. And then up there where the red vines start. And there was something in the pond that led to that. To under the stage. Anna's guards aren't reporting what they need to report to Anna, and there's something wrong. I feel it. It's what I've been saying for days. I've been trying to stay on edge. Like, you know, like, not, you know what I mean. I didn't want to think about something like this, but then Simon pulled this aside and... 
It's not even 15 minutes till midnight, and I feel like something's going to happen. I don't want you or YB on that stage. Not alone. Ku will be up there. I don't want YB up there. And if YB doesn't go... I don't up, trust Ku. I trust Ku. You know I've been talking to him. Just give me a second. All these kids laughing around. I know. Where's YB? Is YB doing okay? YB's right there. No. It's gonna go talk to Anna. Anna's gonna be asking YB if YB wants to say something. I hope it says no. We'll find out. They're talking now. What do you think about this Midas character? interesting character, but if Casper trusts them, Casper trusts them. What do you think? Who do I think it is? What do you think of the Midas character? Oh, sorry. I'm only thinking about that right now. They seem interesting. Um, I don't know, I feel like we don't even really know them, but I could hear them talking about us while we were in the boat. They're obviously a little weary of us, which I guess makes sense if they just fell from the sky and died in front of us. Yeah. But something they did say kind of stuck with me. They said that this place also has a lives system. Considering it they died right in front of us and they were fine the next minute. Hmm. I just hope everything's going to be okay. Me too. Fifteen minutes till midnight. Yeah. In, in case things go bad, I, I, I actually had a little something I wanted to say for you, but if you think this is not a good time... What are you going to say to me, huh? I was going to tell you that I love you, and that these last four mm -hmm. months of being with you have been amazing. You know, it, I feel like I've been in love with you since the moment I met you. And... <laughs> I know we only started dating towards the end of this year, but I'm looking forward to spend the next year entirely together, and the ones after that. So, I got you a little something. Oh. You picked it up. Let me grab it. <laughs> Come here, flower. You're my rose. Oh, you fucking... Me now I need to get you a flower. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't we just didn't we just go over it? You're the flower. You're mine. And I'm yours. You got me got me millions of flowers at this point. And I thought a rose would be a nice one for something like a New Year's thing. You know? Start two thousand six off right. With you. Yeah. Yeah. Just before I just wanted to say something before things could get ugly. If it does. But I love you, Melody. I do. I love you, Jay. Immensely. Immensely times two. <laughs> Can't use that every time. Oh, I try. It's not like you challenge it or anything, so I guess I keep winning. And I have you, so You're it does make me a winner. Well, I have you, and that makes me win every time. You're my winner. You're my winner. I love you. 
I love you. <laughs> Just hold my hand, okay? I know it's going to be okay. a little nerve-wracking, but... I Oh, shoot. I did tell Anna I'd sit up front, just in case. Could we just move up next to Sesby? Okay. 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 But if you get on that stage, I'm going with you. Okay. Do you have any weapons on you? Of course I do! I don't leave the fucking house without a weapon! Are you insane? Oh. Where's Sesby? Let's go. Hey, Sesby. Hello. You doing okay? Yeah, I'm alright. Yeah? I noticed you're not really wearing a jacket. Are you not cold? I'm kind of freezing. No, not really. I don't really get cold. Oh. No, just wanted to say hi. I know it's been a minute. So, hope you've been doing well. Yeah, yeah I've missed you. I've missed seeing you around. Yeah, well, this is my first time in Asphus, and I'm very impressed. I'm really happy with how things look. I I hope you like it too, since you know you've been here. I do like it a lot. You know, and is staring at us. People are so, great. Hi. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Did I interrupt? Sorry. No, no, it's fine. No, it's alright. We're just no, uh, catching up. Yeah, I talked to YB. YB agreed to say just a little something, so I think after YB is done... You can also say something if you, if you want, or if you think that it would be enough, then it's, it's up to you, basically. I don't know. Now I'm thinking about it, and I don't know if I want YB on a stage again. I wasn't there the first time that something happened to it on a stage, and I don't want to be here the second time, if something Look, happens. I, first of all, we don't have to even put YB on a stage. YB can go, like, here or something, I don't know. Oh, and and then I, I'll be on the stage. Who will be on the stage? We'll keep YB safe. I promise. What do you think? We can all keep YB safe. Why are we keeping YB safe? From what? <sighs> We're just worried that someone might have tried to hijack the party. But there is also a possibility that it's just they are goofing around. Mm. So we don't know for sure and until we know, uh, we're kind of on standby. So be careful. <sighs> okay. But yeah, um, well, yeah. If you if if we don't want YB on the stage, it's fine. We can just have it stay like right here and say something. No, YB's wanted a little bit of independence. If YB made the decision on its own, mm -hmm. I will do what I can from here, and then I'll say a few okay. words. Right. Good. Okay. Then it should be fine. We have like ten minutes left. I'll um go. Okay. See what the others are up to, and we'll go from there, okay? Alright. Alright. Good luck, Anna. Thank you, Jay. Things are a little tense, but I know we're just minutes away. It's about to Sadly. Be Not even ten minutes. Is it when the moon's in the middle of the sky? No, I think it's right where it needs to be. sit and wait. You look nice in your suit. Thank you. Um, it's an old suit. I wore it a little while back. Um, haven't worn it since. Don't think I'd still fit in it. But uh, Melody and I decided to match. It's a very similar suit. Yeah. I was 
just walking around the town and I found this sweater. I like it a lot. Do you have, like, clothing stores nearby? Yeah, something like that. There was a tailor or someone. I thought Anna would like it. Hmm. What's been going on in Marigold? Anything interesting? Not a whole lot, actually. It's been very quiet. That's um, very unlike Marigold. Seems yeah. Like there's always something over there. It's been three to four months of just nothing. You know, long deserved nothing. But I, I will admit it's been a little boring, so that's why I've been looking forward to this trip. I haven't been out, out here before. All that I really knew about Asphus, or at least you here, was that Rain was sending you letters at one point. Yeah, we're pen pals. Huh. We've been sending letters to each other. That's nice. It has been really nice. Well, the moon's still moving. Mm -hmm. It's almost directly over us now. Does that mean it's almost New Year's? Just a few minutes, yeah. Maybe five? Six? It's my first time being at something like this. We would have had one in Marigold if we weren't dealing with a demigod, and that was before you showed up. It was right around this time we were dealing with some bad things in Marigold. But, uh... Yeah. Sometimes it just feels like the world's holding its breath, you know? I'm Something holding my breath. I think a lot of people are holding their breath with you. I'm just worried. Anna's not seeing things how I'm seeing it. And I get it. That's what perspectives are for. But there's just something wrong. I don't want to believe it. It wasn't until Simon was all up in my face telling me how worried he was that I really started to feel it too. And Melody and I just came back from just relaxing in the library because we we're cold and it's a little bit warmer over here thanks to the, the giant radiating bird. Phoenix, right? Also Anna. Yeah, just the... Anna's very warm too. I heard YB is now too with this uh, device. It looks like everyone's coming back now. It might be starting. I mean, it is almost midnight. You excited? Excited is definitely a word. Mm hmm. Not saying that I am. I mean, I already told you the one thing I'm excited about. Going home? <laughs> With you, yeah. I don't mind that. Oh, Jazz. What is Jazz up to? One second. What are you doing? Sorry, I uh, I think I'm coming down with a cold. My nose has been a little Aww. dry. I need more out here. I poured a wine. Yeah, I'm going to need to go inside somewhere after this is done. 
Yeah, we can maybe stop in the library and then head home after yes. this. You're not cold at all? You don't feel your nose fucking caving in on itself? <laughs> not as bad as you, but I guess I'm a little chilly. And I thought I was used to the cold. I'm not liking this at all. <laughs> uh, okay, maybe we turn behind us and go talk to these people. Yeah. All right, just hold my hand, okay? I will. Carrying the moon and the sun, and that they're always in equal opposition. How are you guys doing? We're talking Pretty about good. how the sun and the moon work. Oh, yeah? There's yeah. something in the universe that draws everything closer and closer to it. All right, Puffer. It, we don't know what it is, but it's called You're the Grand up. Tractor. Want to yep. go grab Ace? Yeah, there is the, uh, the chapel. Chapel. That's uh, that over there, right? Yeah, that one. All right, I'll go grab him. Thank yeah, you. the entire universe is traveling towards something or another. We don't know what will happen when we get there. Well, the it's moon's right above us, so it's about to be like midnight. Blow up. Hmm? Do you think we'll all just blow up? I don't I know. Have no we idea. will not blow up. What? We're not. No. No. Nothing. Is I was blowing talking. Up. No, I was talking about. When Sorry. We and let's get to the great big middle that we're all being sucked towards. Yeah. Yeah, there's this thing called the Great Attractor. Everything is getting pulled towards it at all times. And we're not sure what it is or what happens when we get there. But hey, we're Simon. going there. there it's going to be, be a long, long time. But the moon's almost above us. That's almost midnight. New Year. Might want to yeah, tell Anna. We're, we're about to get started. I already told Anna. Uh, Puffer is going to grab Ace from the chapel, and then I think we're going to get started. Okay, well. People only go to the chapel when they're getting married. Who's he getting married to? Who is getting married on warm the new up. year? People are getting That's kind married. Of odd. Yeah, I wanna go. I wanna go be the. What's the guy that says? Uh, you you may now smooch. Uh, I know they get ordained in order to do that. Oh, a minister. Minister. Yeah, that guy. I is think. that what they're called? I don't know. Simon, I don't anything else? I you think just, it'd be just, fun. I'm fine. Just. Isn't it? Can't you just tell two people will be to all right. kiss and then it works? Like you two kiss. Uh, now I'm a minister. See. I don't think that's I how that works. It. I think that's hey. called a maker. Thank you guys. No, I think I did. We're about to get started. Mm. Mm. Sai, you and Anna should kiss. I'm a minister now. <laughs> I uh, kiss, 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 kiss. Um, that's guys, we, we miss Christmas, okay? Awkward. That's when we have the mistletoe. No, 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 but somebody said so we can do it again. Yeah, I thought it was somebody New Year mistletoe. Cat had said. Don't you like kiss on New Year? What? Mm -mm. Yeah, I yeah. already, I already yeah, kissed I the ground, year, so I'm good. You want... Hey, Sash, we have a question. I'll, um... Yeah? Kiss these Do you berries. eat rocks? Am I not supposed to? I was right! What? Please don't just... eat rocks. Are what you... is what happening? It was rock soup. Yeah, I had to replace Sesby's teeth. No, what? you didn't. What? what? Fine. Excuse what? me? He's lying. He's lying. <laughs> My teeth are so okay. strong. Are they strong because side? Yeah, Sesby eats Never mind. Yeah, Sesby is strong what? because I've trained them. I've trained them by eating progressively harder and harder rocks. You told me about the hardness scale of rocks, so I'm working my way up to diamonds. One day That's I'll be there. No. Maybe let's not eat diamonds. Sand. Actually, or... isn't hey, just uh, rocks? Hey, and diamonds. Hey, Anna, the and, uh, moons are really almost tried. right above us. I tried a long time ago. It, it doesn't. Yeah, I'm, yeah, yeah. I was just coming there to say that oh, we should always start. Uh, because I, I think that everyone is here Wait. yet. When, when the moon gets we waiting... people above us, is that when... Yes, that That's is when midnight. Everyone it's almost midnight. We got, yeah, like, not... maybe a minute or two. I regret right. informing you about yeah, that decision. Then... <laughs> yeah, I've never had a New Year's. There's not really a sun or moon in there. Okay, and... I think we should... Yeah, we should oh. start. Okay. So, hi everyone. Sorry for everything that happened today i'm sure that we were all expecting this event to not be as scuffed as it actually was but i'm hoping that everything is fine now and i have a little something to that i would like to say to all of you i am really happy to see you all here and see you all, all together uh, i know that i've met you over lots of different periods of time but it's been really good to know and it's been really good knowing every single one of you. And this is a very special day, uh, and it has been a very special day in the place where I come from. It's the day when we say goodbye to one year and greet the other one. 
2005, the year that we're celebrating the end of, will forever remain in our history as a challenging, contradictory and intense year. Perhaps, I think even more than ever, we felt a threat to the life we were accustomed to. Um, it may not have been easy for some of us, but I think there were good moments. There were moments that didn't have us worry every single second. Worry about our friends and those we care about, those who I think we can even call family. This year made us aware of the value of peace. It made us understand how a single person's choice can be damaging to the whole society and how important it is to work together if we want to achieve a common goal. It made us see that it's dangerous to depend only on ourselves. It made us value transparency, and not only between the government and its people, but between people themselves. Society is like a person's body. It's enough to cause a slight disturbance in the whole system to just feel feverish. And I think that some of the events of this year gave us a great example of this. I want to say sorry to, for everyone who got hurt, for everyone who lost their lives, and for everyone who might have lost their friends. May the light of the eternal flame guide them in their path wherever they end up being. This year has also been a year of political choice, year of questioning our preferences, year of testing our loyalties, year of deciding what's best for us and those close to us. Sometimes we chose right, sometimes, well, we made mistakes, some more crucial than others. But what's important right now is that a new year in 2006, we can't afford to just turn over a new leaf and forget about the hardships that we went through. They are something that should stay in memory of generations on end in everyone's hearts. We need to seek wisdom in our history. We need to learn from our mistakes and work together on fixing them and not just erasing them. Therefore, here in Astfus, I declare 2006 the year of historical memory. For without respect for past, there is no future. But not all the pages of our history that year was dark. The population of New Evergreen, the population of Marigold, the population of Astfus, they all grew significantly. We met new friends and greeted those that we thought were lost. Um, we became stronger, we grew as people, we learned. Now we have experience that will guide us in the future. We have people to look up to, people to care about. We have people to protect and be protected by. Some of us became closer than they could have even imagined, I think. And this is what we should focus on. Uh, with the lessons we already have, we shall bring our full attention to making our community better. Making our towns, places that we are proud of, places that we would want to protect, places that we would want our loved ones to share with us. Making those who we care about safer and happier. Peace is our main achievement this year, and we should work hard for it to become a constant in our lives. But you know what? All of this starts tomorrow. Today is the day where I hope we can and should breathe freely. Today is the day to forget our differences and quarrels, to smile and laugh, to enjoy one simple fact. We are all alive. We are alive and we are here and we are making one more step into the future together. So may this new year be better than the last one. In fact, may every new year be better than the previous one. And may it be then when we gather together in exactly a year from now, our smiles will be wider and our community will be tighter than ever before. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy Woo! New Year. Woo! Woo! Yippee! Right. Um, if mm. anyone would like to um, say anything, anything at all, I would love to welcome them on the stage. Don't look at me like that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You got this, Wyman. Uh, I believe in you. Woo. Okay. Um, I don't have even remotely close to a scripted, nice, fancy speech at all. I was asked to do this like 10 minutes ago. Um, I just want to thank everyone for being here and for joining us here in Asphys. This year has been rough for everybody involved. <sighs> everyone lost. Everyone grieved. Everyone had something happen. 
but each of us grew independently from that, grew as a community as well from that. And I think that's almost poetic. We're all still here, or at least most of us are still here. I just, I don't know. There's a lot of things that I wish I could say or could think of right now, but just thank you all for being here. And have a happy new year, I guess. That's it. Yay! Yay. Do you like it? Anyone else? I will. Okay. Thank you, everyone, for stopping by in our home. If you don't know me, which most of you do, my name is Simon. My only goal that I've ever had in my entire life was to pursue happiness. Pursue how happiness can be created, how it can be shared, how it can be improved. I am a man of science. I am a man of imagination. My entire goal that I've always had was to just make the world a better place ever since I got there. From Marigold to here. I met so many amazing people over the course of my life. Anna, YB, Jay, so many more people. Sesby, even some of the newer people, like Ram over there, some people I don't know much about. But regardless, I'm happy that I've met everyone here. And I hope that in the future, everybody stays, you know, happy. I hope I can help with that. Good luck in the next year, everybody. If I could successfully else? clap, I would. Yeah, I'll say, I'll say a little something. Alright. Hello, everyone. My name is uh, Jay Birkenell. If you guys know me, uh, you might know where I come from. It's Marigold. Um, first president, and hopefully never again. Because that's something mm. I don't want ever so um sorry i came with jokes um recently 2005 has been looked at as a very challenging year a year full of mistakes but equally good triumphs and i'm happy to be a part of a community not just marigold but of our communities that are in partnership with us like asphus new evergreen san Jose, and beyond and maybe even more communities in the future all I can tell you all is that I'm a proud of where I am today, and I'm proud of each and every one of you for, you know, being here and developing over the times that you've made here, whether you're from Marigold, Asphus, or anywhere. You being a part of our community makes this all worth it, and this is how it starts. And I couldn't be more happier knowing that I am a trusted figure, a friend to you all, and I just want you all to know that I'm, I'm just happy. I wish you all a very merry, well, Christmas is over, but uh, a happy new year. And, you know, be merry, be happy, and look proudly into 2006. Because just as Anna said, with next year, we'll be tighter and we'll be better. So thank you, and have a good night. Hey, Jay. Mm -hmm. yeah. Part two, if I could clap, I would. Anyone else? Um, yeah. Welcome. Ooh, Rain has something to say. Um, hello, everyone. Um, I didn't know I was gonna have the guts to come up here. <laughs> but, well, I'm here talking to all of you. I'm glad that we're all gathered here today to celebrate. I mean, we all have a reason to be happy. 
some of you survived this year against a lot. No matter what life threw at you, you are here today. Some of you had it slightly better, but that does not mean that you had it easy, no matter what you went through. <sighs> but what we did this year is we made friends. We are alive. We are here together. And as much as some of us walk out of this year with new fears, new nightmares to dream about, we also walk out with new friends, new people by our side. This year has been hard. I mean, <laughs> after everything some of you have been through, it's, it's just, <laughs> it's just enough to say that it's been hard, but you got a new perspective on life. You walk into the new year with new lessons to learn and new friends to make. And you're gonna get through it, whether life throws bricks and stones at you or flowers and happiness. But the most important part is that you get to experience it. You get to live another day. You get to see another sunrise. You get to see more stars. But you get to do it. And that's the most beautiful thing. But we're all here gathered today to celebrate it. So I think we should give it up to Anna one more time for bringing us all here together. Yay. Yeah, <laughs> Come on, Anna. Those were to go Come off. here. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> what was that? Let me too. Hold on, let me see. Rain? Um. Wait, what? Rain? Well, we'll see, Anna. Won't we? Do, what? No. <laughs> At rain? <coughs> oh my. Um. What the oh, hell just shit. happened? What I the hell just happened? I knew it. I fucking knew it. Something that always happens. Okay. okay. I'm okay. Oh, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Holy You're okay? I, d I didn't get hurt. I'm You're fine. right, Casper. I, I fucking knew it. Were. God, I knew it. What did they just hand you? It's a book, um, Simon. <sighs> Next year, I will test your limits, Anna. We'll see how long it takes to break you and run. Let's see how long it takes. Sick fuck. What? Damn oh, it. That's not, that's not rain. It... Couldn't be. Uh, hold Thank on, you. hold on, hold on. Yeah. Jay, no. hold, on. hold on. Uh, guys, guys, I would like J, Y, B, Casper, uh, Simon, and Coop. Could you please follow me? Puffer, can you make sure that the rest are okay? Melody, you too. Of course. Uh, All right, me. come on, everybody. I need to talk to you. Sesby, are you okay? Sesby, look at me. You okay? Sesby, okay. are you okay? I'll talk to you in a minute. Let's go. I've been there sooner. I should have. Let's go. Thanks for nothing, virus. guards. They couldn't have reacted they to killed. this as fast. They should have seen the sword. All right. I, I don't know what to say. That. that... Hold I on. know what to say. Hold on. You don't know the full story yet. I thought we'd be moving. Hold on. Wait, there's just something weird about it. There's something weird Where's... about rain. Where's Jane Melody? Hi. Sorry, we're, we're a little behind. Oh, guys, 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 not upstairs. Oh. Come to the town hall. We should split up. Yeah, that's yep. what I did. Yeah, we... Just maybe. 
Thank you. I came here first. That's why I was behind. Uh, okay. okay. Should, okay. I don't know. So, I don't know what the fuck happened there. Oh my God. Okay, so um, I asked Casper to be here because Casper um, might have been the witness of how this whole story even started. Because okay, Jay. First of all, I'll read this. Um, oh, you if you didn't hear, I if you didn't hear that Simon, what Simon said. I knew so, it. Simon, give me a second. So, I, this, what happens is this is this is crazy. This yes, crazy. it is. But this is not the first time. What are you talking about? Rain wouldn't do something like that. Not to you. Okay. But why, BC? She already yeah. has. J yeah. What? Jay, give me a second. Okay, so a couple of days after I left Marigold, and I thought for good, before Simon woke up from the coma. Um, I was trying to find a remnant from my past, but I read the map wrong, and I ended up near Devil's Town, like back near the place when you, we found where fo we found you after you went after Ashram Moss. Okay. And I saw Rain, who was heading back from Devil's Town, and we had a chat, and um, Rain was really upset. I gave Rain the picture of her moss and asher um and a goodbye letter from asher and rain seemed real upset that he didn't come say goodbye to her and i think she was like just i thought that I, she was just really upset because of all of this and then she stabbed me uh, what and then casper had to shoot what? her Dude. Because this doesn't make any that. fucking sense. You're talking about when you left the Marigold, so you had been gone for a while. Yeah. After JD three left days. and put YB in charge. Of... Yeah, it was like three days after I left Marigold, maybe two. I um, talked to Rain that day. I, I, Yeah, there were some unspoken yeah, things yeah. there but about Asher and Moss, and I understood that, but I was willing to look past it. But she's never said anything like how we're talking. Like, this doesn't make any sense. Yeah, she... She did that, and then she ran away after Casper shot her, saying that we would never talk again or something like that. I don't remember for sure. I, it's so fuzzy. And then Casper and I talked, and Casper helped me a little bit. So it was fine. And today, well, she was messaging, she was sending letters to Sesby, and it seemed fine. Like, I saw one of their letters. I picked when you guys left, and everything looked fine. And she was communicating with me really well, and I mean, she said this whole speech, and everything was fine, and then she went to hug. And you. then suddenly, she just gives me this book. Casper, you were so right. I should have taken action before anything happened. I, I, I was. I never I, should. I had my crossbow. Why didn't I shoot her the second she pulled out that stupid fucking sword? I, God damn it. You didn't hit you with it, did it? No, 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 no. She just pushed me with her hand. She didn't. Oh, no. She didn't. She didn't. She didn't do anything. Ku, you okay? Thank you, Ku. You. Ku. The guardsmen. Rain is on Look, a walk. fine. They're not allowed in the town anymore. Kill on sight. This doesn't make sense. No I've been, I've been. No kill inside. Look, we have we have laws. No kill inside. I'm talking about rain. Exactly. No kill inside. What they did is unforgivable. We don't have a kill inside law. I just don't want this to end up the same way that Asher went. It is not going to. If anything, if rain shows up here, we will arrest her and we'll we'll put her on trial. Although, hold on, if. Ven, oh, Ven is not here. Damn, yeah, and she wouldn't Ven know about this too. About might... what? About her stabbing me, or about this? Because Ven is not about, here. About Rain in general. Didn't they like grow up together or something? Yes, well, yes, they did. We sh we could ask Ven whether he knew that something has been going on, but I, I don't know how much. As far as Rain I know, Rain doesn't really talk to Ven anymore. Same with Isaac, and they all knew each other. L listen, you guys don't know Rain like I do. Okay, it's not it's not a popularity contest. Okay, but I've been with Rain these last three four months, from the day that we spoke about 
me wanting to know where YB was being kept by Moss and Asher. That's how Rin and I met, and it wasn't on good terms. But we crossed that bridge, and the day that YB became president was the same day that I offered Rin the job at the hospital. She needed a change of pace. She needed a, to not think about them anymore. She was thinking about leaving. I convinced her to stay. Yes, she... And, and she's done so much in Marigold these last three months. Not, granted, nobody really gets injuries or illnesses, but Rain has been our doctor. Since Simon left, Rain has been our doctor. She was just a nurse practicing medicine. She went through sur She's like a surgeon. She's been... For fuck's sake, she prescribes me acetaminophen for my heart palpitations and my concussion from three months ago, which is now starting to end. This... Look. This doesn't make sense. She... I've been a, there for her. She... I've seen... I've seen that picture that she has of Asher and Moss. It's in her office. I knew she had a letter. I just didn't know how she got it or how... You gave it to her. Ugh. Look, I understand. And... Oh, go on, Casper. There's this look in her eyes and this feel about her and it's not right. I've seen her before now and it was different then. It was different. I can't... No, Casper, you were absolutely right. I should have taken action much sooner. I should have told no, you're Rain is not a monster. Listen, something They're not. They're not a monster. No, there's just something We're talking about kill on sight. We're talking about wrong. finding them and keeping we're eyes on We're talking about kill on sight. Exactly. I'm trying to prevent it, Jay. I'm Look, okay. Rain is still Hold very on. young. She's Look. This is why I don't really want to do anything. Look. I'm not trying to accuse Rain of anything. If anything, I didn't tell anyone because I wanted everything to be fine and I wanted to check on her first and everything seemed fine today and this is why I also proceeded to not tell anyone except for Ku because well Ku and I have a history of that but uh, I only told Ku um, I didn't tell anyone I didn't want anyone to be worried about that and worried about her because I knew that she is a child and she maybe she was just upset fine that happens I didn't know she was going to repeat that. And I don't want to accuse her of anything. And I know that you know her. I know that you've been there for her, probably. And she might have been there for you. And that's understandable. But also, I have to keep into keep in consideration some other things. Anyways, I understand. But just be careful. Because if she is back in Marigold or in New Evergreen right now... Um, I really hope that she's fine and that you can talk to her. But just... Please be careful and don't go anywhere near her alone. There's just gotta just be an case. explanation. There's just she wouldn't just. There's do gotta that. be an explanation. She had to have been coerced or right. paid or something. She probably was just manipulated. It happened with Asher. It'll happen with someone else. I just didn't want to believe it. And it's not rain. That's not rain. If it's not the rain I know. Okay, but I don't want people trying to hurt Anna. I don't want people Stick. to hurt Anna. Listen, you don't know Ring how I do, okay? You haven't been there. It's not just Rain. It's Rain. It was there. And then Asher tried to manipulate. I'm so tired of people trying to hurt the people I care about. I don't want there around anywhere. Oh, Anna can have there. There can stay here in Asphus. I don't want him in Marigold either. And Asher's gone. There should be gone. And if and Rain doesn't deserve to be gone. You're the person that fucking found her in the first place. Listen, it's not that I don't... You're misunderstanding me. I just want everyone to be okay. If oh, Rain I, I don't isn't bat shit out of their mind, then fine, fix them. But I don't. That want wasn't them Rain. Indiana. What? What are you talking about? Get, come on, the look in their fucking eyes, the way that their personality changed. You think they have some kind of a disorder or something? Did disorder, they? fucking something in their mind that just spread at that last second. I don't fucking know what it is. That wasn't Rain. Look, I may have never been good on terms with Rain, but I can tell that fucking wasn't Rain. I don't know fucking know what it is, but I'm the one who fucking killed Rain. I saw Rain's eyes as she died, and that wasn't fucking Rain who I killed. None of you okay. know Rain. None of you know Rain like that. I've I've been the one trying to understand and then be there for what her. What the fuck was it if you know her so much? What the fuck was that? I don't know and I wish I did. I wish we could have done something instead of just kill her immediately. Figured out whatever was 
happening. I don't blame you for so doing weird. the action that you did. It's just... She's only a no, year Jay. old. She's only a year fucking older than YB. No, Jay, I thought I knew Rain. And I thought I could trust Rain long before that. And then when the whole thing started with Asher... Uh, well, I mean, I've been in the Conventus with Asher long before it became the Council. And it's not... I'm not accusing her of anything, but let me just say that back when uh, Rain and I followed Puffer, who brought YB, you know, into the prison, uh, I left Rain there to... because we thought that Asher would tell them anything, and then she never told me anything the next time we met each other, and then she disappeared, and then everything was fine with Asher, apparently, and they were buddy buddies again. So I don't know about that. I'm not saying that I'm accusing her of anything. I'm saying that she might be easily manipulated. I don't know. I don't She's... know, and I don't want her to accuse her of anything. I'm I'm worried about her if anything. But let let's just be careful. Okay. You know what? Fine. Let's just say that that was not Rain, like who said, and that Jay has been blinded. <sighs> so fine. But we still need to know where they are, so if that isn't Rain, they don't go off and try and hurt more people. And so that Jay can talk some sense into them. Well, obviously there would be an Evergreen, wouldn't they? Or at least New Evergreen. Mm, either, e really. either Marigold or New Evergreen. It, she she's yeah, told me she, she told me she just sleeps there. She's always in Marigold working at the hospital. If there's one place I'll, I could find her, it would be there. Probably. Okay. She doesn't she doesn't talk Unless... to Ven, she doesn't talk to Isaac. And I know she doesn't talk to you Unless or she tries to flee. anyone. She talks to Sesby. Do we want to bring Sesby into this? Been... I don't want to bring Sesby into this. Neither but do we I. Might need but... to. Sesby, uh, Sesby would also not appreciate us treating them like a child. Sesby would want to be involved in this. Simon, can you go fetch Sesby, please? Yeah, I'll go find Sesby. Thank you. Simon, I'm sorry for yelling. But you have it's to understand okay. where I'm coming from here. You and no, I don't I, talk I like how we used to, and it's just... I feel like whenever we talk about then and now, it, it's in and out, it's in one year and out the other with you. I don't know how else to tell you. I'm sorry. Okay. I get it, man. I'm just freaked out, is all. I'm, I'm thinking irrational. I'm scared for Anna. That's it. Okay, that's all I care about. Go! If that wasn't Rain and it was some sort of multiple personality thing, then so be it. But she could have hurt you. She had a sword. But she, she didn't. didn't. Did she? she didn't. That's exactly my point. Yeah, but last time she stabbed me and it was a pretty nasty stab. I still don't know how I managed to hide it from Simon this whole time. I don't even know why this wasn't even told to anyone or how, you know, why why she even stabbed she you in the first upset. place. What, did, what could you have even said? I'm not blaming you. That's not what I'm saying. It's just... I know it sounds like it. I'm not. It's, I'm just trying to make Look, sense of everything. She was upset because I had things that belonged to Asher. Like, for example, the ray, the letter that I gave her um, and the photograph. She was upset, upset because she assumed that um, Asher cared more about me than he cared about her. And that's not, I don't think that's even true, but she was upset because of that. And I assumed that she just overreacted. And that was understandable. You guys just came. Um, the council got disbanded a little bit before that. And then um, Asher and Moss disappeared and you got into trouble because of that. I mean, there was all, all sorts of things. But I also have to, hmm. Back when you got hurt, and back you were brought to Marigold. She looked after we, me. When, we went to, yeah, but we went to check on Devil's Town to see if Ashford Moss is still there. And the whole way back, Rain was not sounding all that well. She might have been just pissed because of Ashford Moss. She might have just been worried. But she, the whole way back, she was just talking about how you can bleed to death and how about your trauma and about how dangerous it is for you and stuff like that she seemed a little bit obsessed with it might not be anything i just wanted you to know that that hey. was the case says to be hey 
Jaspi. Hey, buddy. You're fine. Come here. You're fine. We just need to ask you something. Melody, Wybie, Casper, you guys okay up there? I, uh, so sorry, when I went mm, to the uh, the stage area to grab Sisby, it seems like everybody was okay. Okay, that's good to know. Were they talking about what happened? I don't know. The Puffer was sweeping the stage. I, I, I didn't really pay attention. I went and grabbed Sisby. Okay, Sisby. The other guy what? was drunk. Which other guy? Oh, God, not again. Ace? Whichever one wasn't sweeping was drunk. The demon guy? Oh my god. Cool. <sighs> Doesn't matter. Okay, Sesby, look. We don't want to, um... Get into your personal life or anything. But you've been talking to Rain a little bit recently. Was there any... And I mean, anything that could have led to this in her messages, like... Did you have any sort of thought that she might try to pull something like this? I... I mean, I... I have... Some of our letters back in my room, I've been saving them. Hmm. I could... I could go look through them again. That would be probably useful. Because, see, we assume that it was not really Rain who did that. We think that something might be going on with her. So we don't want to accuse her or anything. We just need to make sure that there is nothing that we are missing. No? Sesby, I, I have a question. How long have you known about this party today? The, the New Year's one? I mean, since it was starting to be planned Anna, as soon as Anna told me. When was that? Oh, like a long time ago, like... October, a November? Less than a month. Okay, so early in December? Month. Okay. Like beginning of December, end of November, something like that, probably. I don't know. Did Ray never ask you about a party? Like a date? If it was going to be here? If Anna was going to be there? I mean, I was telling her about it in my letters. See, with all... So she knew there about was one it single, Yeah, there was one single flaw with all's theory of her just freaking out on the spot. And this flaw is the letter that she gave me. She couldn't have written it on the stage. So if it is a split personality disorder or anything like that, then she could have written it before. But if it's not... I mean, even if it's not, let's say it's instead of a split personality, some kind of neurological problem, right? That's not just a okay. personality, it's a whole... Just, just a whole thing that messes up Rain in, in general, mm -hmm. right? Then it could have just been that well, Rain was like this all, well, for some kind of amount of time, however long this brain thing has been going on for. And, you know, Rain could have just been pretending to still be normal. If that makes sense. There's still okay, something then, that doesn't. For there's... so long? For I mean, three it's possible. Man manipulation is a strong thing. I would know. Listen, about people. Th there's still something I can't wrap my head around. If what says be saying is true, when when they were you know being their pen pals, I, I know that was a thing. Rain told me herself once, but it was the day after you, the three of you, came into Marigold for the little dinner that YB hosted. I went to go you know get my checkup with Rain to check in on her because she wasn't at the dinner. You guys remember she wasn't there. I had asked her if she even knew about the New Year's party that was going to be in a week. She told me she had no idea, that she just quickly commutes out of Marigold just to get to work. And she goes right back home to sleep. And that's that's her day-to-day. -day. She apparently never looked around and saw the posters for the party that you went and put up. I asked her if she would be going and she didn't even know what was happening. So if Sesby did tell them back in December, I don't know why she would just forget by uh, not even a week ago. 
I have two theories about that. Then okay. it could be that either if it's split personality, maybe it's the thing that's going like back and forth. You know, so maybe when Sesby sent the letter to Rain, it was the other personality that got the letter, and not actual Rain's so normal Rain wouldn't remember it. Okay. And well, the then, second uh, theory could just be that, well, Rain just pretended not to know. True. I've been. I... Out of everyone in this room, I've been the closest with her. I, I've been there, you know, helping her. Is a strong thing, Jay, so who really knows what could have been? I know what I've seen, and it just doesn't make sense. Okay, well, then I propose an idea. Yeah. Okay. How about we go off and find Rain, right? That one seems You're to be all You're not going off to Rain. No, I'm not trying to say that we do anything to them. Well, yet. I'm saying we go off and find Rain. We bring Jay, Jay tries to talk to them. In the happenstance that it is real Rain, and they are, like, scared and, and apologetic and crying, and Jay's like, everything will be okay. We cuff them. Bring him to his cell, right? That's the first part. Because obviously, you know, you're not uh, gonna walk free. Simon? So, I have an idea. It's a bit immoral, though. And if you say no, then that's understandable. But so far, most of the theories have led to some kind of thing with, with, with the brain. So, what if we checked Brain's no. brain? No. That's exactly what I was going to actually no. propose. No. I was I'm this. saying we're no. Not, we're not doing this again. We're not I'm going not... through this again without no. Rain's consent. That's where I was about to say. If it was actually Rain, the real Rain, then they would consent to it. We ask Jay to ask them if they were willing to go through the process. Hook them up to the memory machine. I go into their head and put together what this whole thing meant. But if, if they say no, then it's a no. And if they say no, that brings us more suspicion that Rain was never who they actually said they were. Look. Rain it's is a kid. It's risky every time. Especially with Rain being a kid. Her brain is not even fully developed yet. Listen, it's... Okay, it's... look, hold on. There are simpler methods. This is the final method. This is if we don't find anything by any other means. What I think we could do, we could ask Chapel if we ever find Rain, if we like either lock her up or just know where she is, we could ask Chapel to perform a psychological evaluation first to see if Chapel can find anything wrong with her. Okay. I guess so. Listen. I know that she's probably not going to tell us, but I could try to ask mm -hmm. Reggie. Mm, I don't think that's a reliable, reliable source of information. No, it's got to be someone well, in this room, right. and and I'm the closest, and maybe then like YB, maybe or even Melody. But no, it's not about talking to her. It's about just knowing. But yeah, what were you gonna say, Jay, before that? I get we're still, you know, reeling from this whole thing, and I know Ku only did what was right, and I trust Ku's judgment. He and I have been very close lately, but still, the fact remains that Ring didn't stab you. So even if this was a... Not uh, today. Not today. I know it happened a, a while ago. Maybe she got better. Maybe there was something that changed in her mind. I don't know. I'm not just dumbing it down to say that, oh, she changed her mind one day and decided not to ever hurt you again. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying that a after everything, we could have at least tried to stop her from, from killing or hurting you, Anna. It didn't mean she had to die. We might have made matters worse. Hey, Tenji, you were high. We were already on high alert. That was the only outcome that was going to happen. Because, yeah, with the security breach and with everything, I'm afraid that it's just... Rain is not just some traveler who just came across some town that was having a New Year's party and decided to shit stir. This is someone we all equally know whether we know her very well or not really. Jay, okay. you think I'm not upset about her death? I didn't want this to happen. I never wanted this to happen. But it happened, and we have to deal with the consequences now. 
just felt like we jumped into the conclusion. The consequences of that, and of the consequences of the fact that yes, she did not stab me now, but she did stab me before, and she threatened me with the letter that was pre-written. Can I just say something to clear my own case a bit more? Sure. So, we all know when Asha was around. At least some of us actually remember all of the stuff that Asha did while some of you were gone. Uh, well, as we know, Rob is gone and dead. Right? And the thing is, a lot of us were there at Rob's ex execution. Including me. And I was the closest one, not including Asher and Moss, to Rob. And I always say that I could have saved him, but I never did. And as he was being executed, all I did really was laugh to play my part. And, you know, seeing Anna up on stage and Rain taking out the sword, just like Asher did to Rob. I just, I, I could have probably seen that Raina wasn't actually going to stab Anna, but I just couldn't. I just acted instantly, and then next thing I know, Rain's dead. So, Ooh. you're I don't, fine. I don't blame you, Ku. I just think that we're all kind of numbed by public executions or just deaths in general that we jump to something. And I'm not blaming anyone in this room for that. I'm just saying it's worth thinking about. You know what? I I need I need I need to think. I'm gonna I'm going to the lab. I am going to relax for a second. I can't handle this right now. Where it says I'm gonna grab the guardsman. Oh. I'm sorry that I'm bailing, but I. I'm going to lose it. I'm going to relax in the lab for a bit. I'm going to clear my head with something. Don't know. I'm sorry. Okay? I'm going to try to take care of the situation. I need to check on the rest of the people and... Party's over. Probably talk to the guards. I know. But I need to see if anyone wants to stay here or... If people need to be helped get into Marigold, or if anything, me... I, don't, I don't know. I, I haven't okay. told Melody yet. Oh, do you? Down. Do you guys have like a hotel or something? I think I'd like oh, to stay right. for, for some time. If you and Melody want to stay, um, you can just take the house with a purple roof for yourself. It's it's empty. No, it's been furnished, but that's not necessary. You don't have to do that. Look, it's. No, but nobody lives there. Okay. Okay. I'll, I'll listen, talk to Melody. Uh, I just want you to be comfortable. I gotta go. I gotta go talk to Sesame. They're, they're... Simon, I'll they're... I'll be sticking around for a little. We'll we'll talk soon. Okay. Just if you need me, I'll be in my lab. You know where I. Yeah. You know where I hang out. I showed you the overseers area. Yeah. I'm gonna talk to Melody about staying here for a few days. Just. We're yes, gonna figure something out. Thank you. Just know that you got my trust right now. Alright, I gotta go. Wait, hold on, Simon. Simon. You know what, I think I should go with you and check on Sesby before we split. We really should. Um, Sesby did not look happy. Yeah. Okay. Jay, um, you're gonna be fine, right? If yeah. anything you know, Purple you roof, can find that us. Way? Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's right near the entrance where you entered the town. Yeah, okay. we'll be in the... Yeah, we'll be in the lab, and then afterwards, uh, I'll just, if anything, you can find me in the castle. Yeah, let's have, let's have coffee tomorrow or something. Let's just sit down and hash sure. things out. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'm going to talk to Melody. Do that. You two, okay. do your thing. If you see anyone that I haven't seen, just tell them I say goodbye. I don't really... Hold on. Ivy. Hey. Look. I'm sorry. Sorry, you're the one who got attacked. It's not about me getting attacked. I just... I don't know, I just really wanted it to be the... day where you can relax and where everyone can relax and I guess... kind of sort of failed at that. You didn't it's fail, okay. it, was, it was fun. <laughs> well, 
Are you planning to stay? Because you could, your room is still available, you and Casper. Hey, um, I can't stay if Jay and Melody are staying. Right. Right. Um, Casper, you gotta make sure he's fine. Okay. It's not like I don't trust you. I'm just, you know, with everything that happened, I just don't want anyone to be alone. Yeah. Yeah. I'll... I don't know, maybe we, if we have a little bit more free time after this this week, I'll just come see you. But we'll see how it goes. Um, I'll see you yeah, guys a little we'll later. See you. Yeah. We'll see you later, Koo. Mm -hmm. Are you gonna be here as well? I don't know. If you're still around, we should talk. If I am still around, I don't know if I'll have the energy to talk to anyone. Yeah, understandable. If I'm back in Marigold soon, uh, I'll come visit. Uh, so, if Rain didn't really did me any harm, and you two talk to Rain, and is the real Rain, um, just in case my judgment was wrong, just to t say that I'm sorry if I was wrong. Yeah, got it. Sure thing. Um, YB, you doing okay, Casper? I'll live. It's fine. Have you eaten anything since we got here? Yeah. Melody, are you okay? I'm okay. I was just saying to Simon and Anna that I kind of want to make sure we can do something, so I know I didn't ask you first, but would you want to stay here for a few days, figure out what we're doing? I don't really want to go back to Miracle just now. What do we do? Anna's letting us stay somewhere if we want it. Just scout in case Rain shows up again? I... I don't know. I want to think of something of how I can talk to her. Someone's got to try. If you're sure. No one else. You'll be okay. Why be? Yeah, I'll be fine. You two will go home together? Alright. To Marigold? If you're saying something, I can't hear you. Just nodding at me, but okay. Okay, if you guys gotta stay here, then stay here. <sighs> I can't stop you. YB, I, we, we gotta figure this out. And you gotta I be know. back in Marigold and... I know. Look, it, Casper, you guys can hang out at the house if you want to take care of it while we're gone, okay? Just take care of the animals. YB, you know how. Yeah. We'll write you a letter, okay? Okay. Yeah. We'll be home soon before you know it. I just if you ever need us back sooner, don't be afraid to, like, call us. Send someone, send a letter, whatever you have to do. If I need you, I'll let you know. Okay. Okay. You two know now that you two know the way out? The way we came with the boats? If we'll probably just go through the nether. Oh. I was gonna say, you guys can take a boat with you. And, Casper, where's your, uh, old friend? Elsewhere? Okay. As long as you don't leave him behind on accident. Alright. Let's go. Bye. Bye, YB. Bye, stay we'll safe. Stay safe, please. You want to get going? Sure. 
Hey, I'm, I'm sorry. This is not how I wanted to spend New Year's with you. What other way is there to spend New Year's? Preferably without everything that just happened. Just you and me. Yeah. I I want to talk with Simon and Anna tomorrow or the day after. Just We need to think of something. Maybe we won't stay a whole week, okay? But just... Maybe we need a little vacation, okay? Maybe. It's, is it bad that before everything happened and si Simon was worrying that I was kind of hoping something bad would happen so he'd stop talking about how idyllic this town is in front of YB? Simon has got on my nerves a lot. I nearly exploded at him, but... It, no, you're not wrong for thinking that. It might be a bad timing, but... Yeah. But yeah, I don't look at you any I different. Wish... I just wish you would just shut up about all the bad things about Marigold, and especially in front of Waibu, who still lives there and cares about it and is trying to make it a better place. I know. It like, looks... he can be traumatized all he wants, but... It's it not looks... our problem. He can stay here all he wants. Webby well, doesn't want to do that. You know that. I know. There's no changing him. It's... It's Webby's friend. Since forever. I just since, wish he would... Since I've known him. I just wish he would stop. For what it's worth, I would have agreed with you about the Simon thing if nothing happened. If there was nothing about these personality things or... Something just being fucking wrong. Would it be like what happened with Richie? I don't know. I just... Richie kept saying that Sharma was in his head. That house right there. Okay. Purple roof. I don't want to think. How are we meant right to now. get there? There's a path here. Where? Right here. I hate like this path. town. Why is it so confusing? There's a lot of paths, I know. It feels much larger, but I think it's because everything's so scrunched up together. It's not like Marigold just all being on one layer, you know? I think this yeah. is the one. She did say the purple roof. I think we go up these stairs. Yeah. She yeah. said nobody's here, so. Or nobody lives here. Sheep. We have a sheep. Hello? Huh. It's pretty furnished. An actual clock, an actual bell. Oh, well, that just leads outside. So there's a back door. Kitchen. Whatever this is. Bedroom. Just a purple bed. Hoping there's a bedroom upstairs. No. Nothing. We got one bed. So we gotta share one bed. Maybe I'll go. Ooh. <laughs> As if we haven't, you know, you're nearly not sleeping on top of me. It feels very. Listen, it gets cold at night and you're very warm. It gets cold at night and I'm happy about it. I'm just saying that now we literally don't have any room in case, you know. Case what? Well, if one of us falls off or something. I mean, I'll live. Will you live? I, I'll be fine. I've been through worse. I think we. I thought we would bit. go crashing through this glass into this little fish tank. Yeah. Also, this room feels very exposed. The constant glass. I don't want people just staring in here. Maybe we take Who this bed and go upstairs. this? I don't know. I've never yeah. been here before, love. There's not another bed in here. Oh, look at that. Maybe we're just blind. Yeah, let's move him upstairs. Yeah. We'll put him back how we found him. Just, we need to sleep somewhere that's not so exposed. Here's fine. Feels Is like it? an attic. But that's how YB sleeps, so. Maybe we get to be in his shoes for once. 
here. Is that okay? Or you want to put it up against the wall? I think this is okay. Yeah? Well, I kind of just Do you want to be then. against the wall? What do you prefer? What do you prefer? Let's put it up against the wall. Okay. I picked up the other one. Hang on. Yeah. There you go. Oh. <laughs> Tired? Yeah. Just... Just thinking about rain. Yeah. I don't like the idea of sending YB home either. It's just... I gotta think of something. The people in that room when we were talking, they don't know Rain like I do. I know you two were friends, but I know you haven't really hung out as much. Just like how YB and Puffer don't hang out. I'm surprised they didn't hang out today. But... I don't know. Well, you don't know that. We didn't... We didn't... We weren't around YB 24-7. Oh, yeah, that's right. We did go to the library. Maybe they did talk. kind of hoping they did. Yeah. <sighs> and if they know. didn't... Oh, well. Oh, well. I just... I'm really worried about rain. I'm worried about Anna's safety. I'm worried about us being here now. I don't know. Just... I guess what I'm trying to say is Happy New Year. <laughs> I've been continually worried about Rain since she was getting closer with Asher and Moss. I don't think it's because of them, but I do know she's impressionable. I just want to lay down. Wait, Anna said when Rain first attacked her, it sounded like it was about them. You sound hungry. Yeah. I could eat. We can make something after a nap. Yeah. Actually, I could make something while you take a nap. Really? You're not going to go to bed yet? Yeah. I don't know if I can't fall asleep, but... Well, you're hungry. I don't want you to go to bed on an empty stomach. I can have this steak. I meant to drink some apple cider I brought from home. I'm pretty sure the apple cider might be alcoholic. If it's from, from our house? It might be. I am not sure. And I do not want to try it unless you let me try it. If you want to try it. We're going to go to bed anyway. It is slightly alcoholic. I don't want it. Now we have alcohol. You're not having it. I don't want it. I will have it. Did you have anything else left? No, I haven't. I, oh, I do have this to drink and finish. Was it, was it, was it, was it, was it? Was it? Okay. <laughs> you know, ring prescribed me? It's not alcohol. Yeah, yeah. I, mean, I did bring coffee with me. I only got one, though. Yeah, that can be for the morning. Yeah, I'll drink this and finish tonight. Start of the new year. She said I'd be done. Okay, I'm gonna lay down. I probably won't fall asleep, just... Stay close by, all right? If Anna comes by, we'll let her know about the furniture and all that. I will. Okay. I love you. I love you, too. Okay. Well, you know where to find me. I do. <laughs> oh, hey, I did tell Anna maybe we should get coffee with her and Simon tomorrow or the day after. Maybe we need a breather day. I'm guessing to not talk about this stuff. Yeah. I know where to find Simon now. We both do. We can check out the labs whenever. Maybe we'll go have coffee like, with them. Like a date? Under these circumstances, it would be nice to call it that, but there's going to be a bigger picture. So as long as you're okay with that. I mean, sure. I don't mind. Okay. <sighs> we'll decide what we do in the morning, okay? Okay. I'm going to try just to close my eyes, not even fall asleep. I won't be able to. I love you, Melody. I love you too, Jay. Okay. I'll be here. Okay. Bye, honey. I'll be right downstairs. Okay. <sighs> As for son. Hmm. 
fuck are we gonna do now?